Yo, 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 what it do? It's the On The Road Podcast. It's your boy TC with my co-host in the building. God K, you already know what it is. We got a couple special guests in the building. We got my boy Man One. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, man one Battle rapper extraordinaire. We got my boy, the comedian of all comedians, Dr. Dandruff in the building. Hey, what up, what up, what up? Yo, girl's favorite gynecologist. What's up, Damn, man? sound like Dr. <clears throat> Octagon. Yeah, I mean, I get free pap smears, so hey, don't judge me. Hey, <clears throat> do the do the vaginas have dandruff? Uh, sometimes they do, you know what I'm saying? Like, depending on how much cocaine they, they use down there, you know? Because mm. like, it numbs Gets it. Gets dry. A little bit. I mean, mm. As long as they don't have no Joshua trees in the room. Man, you was talking right. about my voice. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's what I said. I'm still going through puberty. Yeah. Hey, don't judge me. <laughs> Just because you went through puberty when you were, like, you five years old doesn't mean voice. shit. He sound like... Tommy Pickles all grown up. Get oh, your man. Shit. <laughs> Get your rug rats. Squints. And, and he sounds like the uncle that's always at the, uh, in front of the barbecue grill, huh? Like, hey, wait a minute. Back up off that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I got this shit. I got this chicken. Body, Y'all back up. And then the he fuck around table. and burn the shit. Yeah. Yeah. Bodyguard of the barbecue. He sounds like an abusive <laughs> husband. Real talk. Like, bitch, what the fuck? <laughs> bitch, where would you take my focus? Like, what the fuck? Bitch? Oh, shit. Uh, much love. Yeah, my God. My God. <laughs> so, uh, you've been on Roast Me a Grip. Yeah, I've I mean, seen a couple it. episodes. Couple yeah. episodes, yeah. I, I'm here for season six, you know. Mm. So Dope. I'll be on my That's way, up. you know. Season five was funny as hell, though. Season five, they say, was that One of the best episodes. Yeah, yeah the best seasons, yeah. Facts, facts. And it wasn't because I was on it, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I mean, hey, I was just, you know, hey, I, you I just set so the mold. To be I'm there. Mexican, and I, I put it down, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I, I held it down like a fat bitch on a seesaw. Mm, I feel it. I tried. Yeah. yeah. You the first, first comedian with a face tattoo on there? Uh, pretty much, yeah. I had them yeah. all scared, you know? <laughs> yeah. They were like, oh, shit, this don't, motherfucker, hey, I'm going to call your parole officer. I was like, hey, hey what the fuck, dog? Hey, like, don't bag on me, roasting. fool. Hey, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> How about that? <laughs> like, I represent East L.A. Hey, 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 hey. You know what I'm saying? Sa- Sadio, Holmes. Real talk, you know what I'm saying? I love it, I fool. I, we, saw, I, I saw churro edibles, you know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? This motherfucker is crazy. Churro edibles. You like that? That's, yeah. fire. that's fire. That's, that's fire. pretty good. That's a good idea. No, that's fire. Palabra? Sal limon con chile. You know what I'm saying? Some Hook it up. Fucking medicated elotes. Don't do that. Why is it gonna be racist? <laughs> <laughs> you know, the, yeah, serio. Like, why is it gonna be racist? You guys ain't shit. The elote king. The elote king, yes. yes. Who got a torch, a flame? I got you, my boy. Real talk. Uh, Trey, so man one. Yeah, it was good. So uh, we just scouted you to magnitude. I don't know if we supposed to say that, but we are gonna say that. Yep, yep. What's yeah, that the, the newest Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. magnitude. <laughs> yeah, like you know, he's the new he Charizard. <laughs> Damn, we should get Vanilla Ice on our team. You feel me? Hey, oh shit. shit. That's Stone that Cold from ro- the 90s. That would be a roasting. Yeah, yeah. yeah we could. I I just snuck one in, you feel me? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Y'all shout out to the midget assassin. (laughs) (laughs) The microphone midget assassin. The telebombs. Okay, we all famous, man. We all famous, man. Yeah, so man, man one's yeah. a battle rapper. Uh, a we got a, a tournament coming up where School of Hard Bars is one of the representatives. Uh, shout outs to the team scout, um, Cali Smooth, you know what I'm saying? We picked up man one as our first pick. You feel me? Yeah, so nice. he on the squad, he on the squad. That's right. Yeah. yeah. yeah I'm about to get that 10K, you feel me? Oh, yeah, I'm saying, I'm yeah, hoping you do. Yeah, I hear who they have in there. I'm not I'm not scared at all, you feel me? That's what I'm about talking to, about. Man, where's the ventriloquist? We're talking about voices. He got a deep-ass voice now. Hey, hey, yeah, who's speaking for me? you? That Somebody motherfucker said it's morphing time. <laughs> hey, guys, they, Somebody they speaking say, for him. <laughs> hey, hey, they say when I rap, I rap like I'm six foot, you feel oh, me? You, you already hey, know, so hey. like... Like he sounds like a black. I'm like this on cam, on cam. You feel me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so so yeah. so speaking of black, we're gonna do. We're gonna dive into into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a crip. Yeah, yeah. A Mexican facts. crip. You can hear facts. it. Oh, wow. facts, yeah. Facts. So so what's that like? You That's know, because even uh, <laughs> they call him a cripo. <laughs> Not a cripple, y'all. It's a cripple. The, the, the blue cord. The blue cord. The, the, the blue, blue cord. Oh, this a, is not the blue, blue electric cord. cord. The blue construction rope? No, was it the, the blue construction cord? Oh, I'm done selling blue a lot. This. Blue ear cord. What they call you? Blue ear cord. What, what school did you go to? Le Cordon Blue. <laughs> Le Cordon Blue. Le Cordon. Le Cordon. <laughs> <laughs> Let's Gordon. go, Gordon. Hey, it's the G right here. So, yeah, yeah. so what? What's that like? Um, uh, you know what I mean? Because, because obviously that's uh, against 
yeah, regular yeah, culture. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, so what's that like being well, a, a Mexican? I'm not the first one. You feel me? My pops, you know. Okay. He, he was that. You feel me? Okay. He was, he was in there. You feel me? Word. From Casablanca, against the Crip. You feel me? Oh, okay. Shit. And um, it started as Five Shadows. You feel me? You mm. know, four Shadows or whatever. You know. And then it was like, a, you know, it was just a drug crew. He came from L.A. Started. You feel me? Just became, you know, what they were out there. You know, my pops were one of the first, and then. You know, from there, uh, I just grew into it, you feel me? What so city y'all hail from? Uh, Riverside. Riverside. Shout yeah, out Riverside. Yeah, yeah. Shout out Riverside. Yeah, so, like... That's the 91. 91 for it. Yeah, so, like, growing up, you know, just being from there, you know, the city that, like, you know, the town in the city that shot down, like, police helicopters and shit, you feel me? Like, mm. for them, you feel me? Mm. But, um, you know, I just grew into it because my pops, you feel me? Like, you know, I just... Probably yeah. my environment. They just yep. follow suit. Yeah. yeah, yeah, facts, facts. And my cousins, you feel me? They from different hoods, Mexican hoods, mm. in the same town, you feel me? And like... Yes, they're, so that's they're, rivals, basically? Yeah, they're, they're CK? Yeah, that, that, that's our ops, you feel me? They they just like right across the street. Mm. So Damn. you go to the middle store, mm-hmm. I cast that fade. Yeah. You mm. feel me? Because Even like, with your own cousin? Yeah. In Riverside, yeah, bro? Damn. Yeah. I didn't know they push NK, CK out there. Oh, no, 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 no. We not, we not CK. We not CK at all. No, not you. you no, 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 oh, no, no. You're no, talking no, about, no, yeah. No, you're no, talking no, about. No, out there, we don't, we don't do that politics. No, okay, no, okay. No, no, no. Not against nah. blacks in general. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. They just, just, they just, yeah, they just against, right. yeah, yeah. Just Because, you know, at Long Beach, the Longos be tripping. Oh, yeah. The, oh, yeah, yeah, the yeah. East side facts, facts. Nah, over here, like, um, they just cross streets, so we just. You know, it's our sometimes it's our cousin, and we just gotta catch that fade. Sometimes mm. it, it takes to pass that. Wait, wait, me? wait! How does that go? Like, hey, bitch, you, I better not see you at the family reunion, motherfucker. I'm gonna, <laughs> hey, we gonna run that fade. Well, sometimes like we grow into this shit, and we don't even know we cousins till we get Damn. into it. And then our family's like, you know, the OGs like, hey, you know, that's your cousin right there. You mm-hmm. feel me? Like, you need to cool it or whatever. You feel me? But right. like, honestly, I don't give a fuck about none of that. Yeah, that's I grew right. up, streets I grew, the streets. I grew up the way I was. You feel me? Like I'm a crib. You feel me? That's I'm right. At the end of the day, mm-hmm. so like at the end of the day, you feel me? Yeah, like you know, it it got like to the point where you know the Mexicans would tell me you need to choose a side. You know mm-hmm. all that shit. You feel me? They try again the politics, and I got phased over that because I was like, nah, fuck that. Yeah, you know, you ain't gonna tell me who I could kick it with. You feel mm-hmm. me? Like. They had my back before y'all did. You feel me? So yeah, yeah, that's how it was. You feel me? Word. So, uh, not to dig in, or if you don't want to answer, but you ever been to uh, you ever been to county or anything like that where you had to uh, deal with the politics on the inside? Nah, nah, no. nah, nah. Word. But, that's what's um, up. My big bro, he just got out. You feel me? And um, he had to deal with the politics. Yeah, he found out I was from where I was, mm-hmm. and you know, he he's from he's from the same set, and you know, he was like, hey. You feel me? Like, I don't know how to feel about that. Mm-hmm. But, like, just, you know, keep your hand on the swivel. You feel me? Yeah. Just do what you do. So, like, he was cool with it. But, yeah, my my big bro, he had to go through all those politics. You feel me? Yeah. And definitely. he wasn't he wasn't locked up in the rib. He was locked up in L.A. So, Damn, he had to go through the L.A. politics. Mm-hmm. So, you know, move in, move, move in. You feel me? Like, you know, it, he, he said how it was. So, yep. you know. Yep. It's a little dip, more yeah. difficult. Yeah, facts. Facts. Word up. Um, so how long have you been battle rapping? Um, I started in twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Word. Uh how many battles you got in right now? Sheesh. Um, probably like almost thirty. Thirty, that's good. Yeah, working. Yeah, Hell facts, yeah. facts. You feel me? Um I started on PLK, Punchline Kings. Okay. Mm. With uh George Burns and uh and Shout Michael out George Wade, Burns. You feel me? So yeah, man. That's that's what's up. Um, what what's your biggest battle as of to date? Um, y'all gave it to me, Poetic Genius. Mm-hmm. You know I mean? um, Fire. I would say Shout Ratchet. Out to PG. I would say Ratchet and K Phil, but uh, those didn't drop. They got both. Okay. You feel me? So uh, PG is the biggest battle that dropped for me. Okay. You feel me? And uh, Smooth and you believed in me to actually bring it, and mm-hmm. you know, I show what I could do. Yep, and you did your shit. Nice. You definitely did your shit. Um, so you you've been on a now roast me twice, right? Yeah, I got a, a season five. That's uh, out. Yeah, yeah, it's out right now. That's released. I got a episode seven, episode nine. Word. Who who else was on your uh, episodes? 
Shit, we had fucking T.I., you know, Tip Paris. We had Baron, Baron Davis. We didn't had Bill Collector. Shout out my boy Bill Collector. Mm-hmm. We didn't had uh, Geechee Gotti. Shout out Geechee. Uh, a few motherfuckers on there that was pretty funny, you know? K-Dub yep. from Atlanta. I mean, um, I got a question for you. Um, go ahead, um, shoot. You was on the one recently with T.I.? No, T.I. That- T.I. was episode one, yeah. And when they was talking about him and Brent? Uh, they look similar and shit. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, I saw, shout I out to Brent. Yeah. Hey, Brent Taylor, shout out Brent. Relax. You know, I it mean. It was like a, a female came in there and she said, uh, Brent, you look like T.I. with no money. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's pretty fucked up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody was crying and shit. I mean, a lot of people don't know that, you know, like uh, a T.I. ended up buying, you know, the like all Def Digital and shit. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. You know, Tip Harris and Baron Davis were ended up, you know, they ended up taking oh, over. You know? Partnership. Mm-hmm. Crazy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They got that off From Russell, uh, Russell Simmons, yeah. That's oh, okay. fire. Yeah. Shout out to Baron Davis, too. Shout I ran into Davis him at uh, DK Donuts, Santa Monica. <laughs> <laughs> at like three in the morning, that fool was in there. He was, he was, he was, he was, <laughs> was wasted. Nah, he was chilling. Oh yeah, I think he just same. ran, ran for the quick donut. They, they're fire donuts. Uh, they gotta be fire donuts to be yeah. up at three in the motherfucking morning and yeah. get some donuts. It was at least two in the morning, something uh-huh. like that. I would have been coming off drugs. Like you know, this is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> My sugar levels down, bitch. <laughs> Yeah, <clears throat> the, the, the one of the places that got like the crazy like cereal on the donuts and oh, all that. Oh shit! Oh, they're doing it like that. Yeah, they I'm got wild. They got Maybe wild donuts. <laughs> donuts on it. It's crazy. <laughs> donuts is crazy right now. <laughs> yeah, you can get a, a donut ice cream sandwich there. A donut ice cream sandwich. That's got to be the most best shit ever. Not the most worst man. best. Not hey, for they, a black man. If you if <laughs> well, you grimy with it, you could get a, a swine. Damn, a uh, swine donut. Imagine for yeah. a chunky person, that's like one donut away from uh, amputation. That's what I'm you saying. Me? Yeah, yeah, you're fucked. <clears throat> Don't go in there if you're fat. No fat shaming. Man, that's crazy. Why you do that? It's crazy. Why you bring up fat people? Uh, I didn't bring up fat people. I like fat people. I mean, I like fat <laughs> girls. You know, they're warm, man. You know, <laughs> it's especially, winter. Especially a time like this, you know? Shit's winter. They then I break up with them, like, warm. you know, before Valentine's Day. Hey, smart <clears throat> move. It starts getting warmer. That's fucked up. Smart move. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, real talk. Why Why before Valentine's Day? Well, because I don't have to buy him shit and it's, it's they getting eat hot. A lot. It's getting hot. Oh, yeah, you they, ride they, and you break up with them yeah. by Valentine's Day. You don't got to buy him yeah. shit. You and know what I'm saying? Sweet in a month or two when taxes come. Like, hey, I miss you. Hey. hey. They cook the best shit. They cook the best shit. Not only that, fat girls got like shit in their fridge. They got like leftover like like lasagna, fucking pork chops, and they got okra, yeah. and fucking, you know, whatever, you know, whatever race if, if she got, fuck with. If she, got skinny, a, if she got a kid, she definitely got snacks. You got oh, damn yeah, right. Yeah. And skinny bitches ain't got nothing but Hot Pockets. They got nothing but frozen burritos. You're like, God damn. She got one to go for. Skinny Yeah, she got, you know what I'm saying? Her, her kids' lunchables are gone. You know what I'm saying? I got to put on his backpack and shit to take him to fucking school. And it's fucked up. I ain't got time yeah, for I it. feel it. You know? know what I mean? She got to have some good pussy, though. If she got good pussy, I will put your kids, you know, my, my stepkids' uh, backpack on and I'll take them to school. Mm. You know, but, it, but if your baby morning? mama ugly, I will discipline that kid. Mm. Like, don't discipline. play with me. So you hit the 300 pound bitch? I will hit a 300 pounds. Fuck yeah. I mean, for credit's good. If she's six, what if she's six foot? If she's six foot, then six I'm foot, a, 300 pounds. I'm climbing that fucking tree. I'm climbing that, six, that sequoia. Oh, you with the Amazonians? Yeah, I mean, yeah. that might be. Mm. You know, yeah, they're know. a little different. Yeah. Let's yeah. go. Swinging. I, I'm fucking with the redwoods. Red. That's crazy. <laughs> I got a little redwood. I got a pink wood. I don't know about a redwood, but I, I got a pink wood. You know little pinky. Yeah, hey, don't uh, do it. Hey, who told you it was little pinky? I'm not whacking nothing <laughs> 300 pounds. That bitch gave me brain, too. She, don't play with me. She put it on OnlyFans. I can't hit It was up there. It wasn't my Yo. fault. <laughs> you can't hit no 300? What, what? It's not Spartan. Sparta. Sparta? <laughs> oh, my goodness. He Sparta kid. Well, he makes it seem like you gotta bring a shield to go fuck a bitch. 300. You know what? Hey, this bitch. Nah, you know? Remember the movie 300? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> this is Sparta. Do with the hump on his this back. This is Sparta. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That motherfucker had the hunchback. Hard, hunchback. He could barely hold his shield up. He was like, this is some bullshit. He said, let me battle. No, yeah. take your ass home. There's a lot of ugly bitches out there. Y'all, hey, y'all be, beware. All right, yeah. all right, all right. There's ugly there. bitch or 300 pound bitch? Uh, depending, mm. depending, uh, depending on her money source. Nah, 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 nah. Nothing else but uh, okay, physical okay. attraction. Oh, physical okay. attraction. Ugly uh, or fat? Which one you fucking wear long term? But yeah. does the ugly got like crazy yeah body body? Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Body? Stop, 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 stop. We're not gonna go deep into it. <laughs> ugly or fat? In long term too, not just hitting it. Just like somebody you gonna. I'm gonna go with, with fat because fat. I mean, yeah. fat girls are always. They got the best hearts. Yeah. Not it only that, crazy. they suck a dick like crazy it because it might be the last one. Look. 
obviously the fat one not probably ugly. That's why the comparison is right there. So the fat yeah, one is cute. Yeah, I'm gonna add that one in. Yeah, yeah she's okay, cute, fat okay. bitch. I'm gonna go with fat. The, the okay, you gotta go with the cute, fat girl. But you gotta deal with them long term. So all right, all right. Yeah, ugly bitch got body. The fat bitch cute long term. Oh, the ugly bitch got body. The ugly bitch. Long term. He fucking like with her. the candy hey, man. Hey, nigga, I put a bag over her head long term. Oh, I, I stole the bag. Doggy style. She's like, I'm not gonna try to convince him. I'm gonna try to convince him. You a battle rapper. You gonna bring your ugly bitch with ass here? Yeah. And we gonna roast you. On stage. He ain't gonna bring both. He ain't gonna bring his big ass bitch built like an Easter basket. Yeah. No, no. The I don't know that bitch when I'm with it. When I'm over. She'll get a pass. The fat bitch that's bad get a pass. How do you have why? Because you give her a pass. No, in real life, when when people see you with a big bitch, but she's cute. They respect you. No, they 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 think you need a ride yeah, to the fucking yeah, to the yeah. place. She's still cute. They think you need a place to stay. Fat, <laughs> like, <laughs> fat girls so always like, got the car. <laughs> they always got. The, they might hold purses at the club if and shit, but they always hold, got the car. Fat girl hold, gotta have her shit look, right. Look, no, can't no, be fat. You gotta pick a struggle. You, you, you got damn right. You be pulling up with a fat bitch and she ugly. You can't be my friend no more. Yeah, real talk. Cause I'm gonna say, damn, it was cute ones there too. That bitch looking like E Honda. The ugliest fat bitch. But so I can't bring I can't bring her over here and then like. Oh, act nah, like I don't know her. Nah, we act like I, you. Come on, nah, we're gonna fire you. If I just act like I don't know her. If you got yeah. a battle, somebody's gonna rebuttal that you brought a duck with ass here. And I'm yeah, that's pretty good. They're gonna be like, "Oh shit, Mark okay, Henry. That, that's he true. bought that's a true. Mark <laughs> Henry. He bought a thick Mark Henry." Okay, okay, that's that true. That's true. Mark that's true. Henry. That's true. That's true. <laughs> that's true. That's <laughs> is this the NFL uh, draft? So, that, uh, so, so if you put it that way, if you're not famous, you you have a better choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since you in the limelight, yeah, like okay, so so. If you put it that way, I'd rather have the cute bitch that's fat. Because she's going to have chains on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's going to look a player. And she, and she probably know how to cook. And then you that don't definitely know how to cook. You said yeah, some of my like, fat yeah. bitch, but we richer than you. Yeah, you know, yeah, Some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, you can't, yeah, you can't yeah. rebuttal that your bitch ugly. She got a body. Woo. So nobody cares. She ugly. Yeah. <laughs> and, 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 hey, yeah, and fat girls yeah. don't want no drama either. You know what I'm saying? Ugly exactly, bitches, ugly bitches true. be like, "What bitch? What they you say?" I'm like, "Bitch, sit down." Cool. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> ugly bitches, hey, they're used to being ugly all their life. We they don't give a fuck about got, their faces. All the ugly bitches on the camera are gonna be like, "Why y'all trying to talk him about talking to me?" You know what I'm saying? Y'all sending him to the fat bitch. Hey, hey. We all know pretty girls can't fight. What about your fuck? That's true. That's true. Uh. I mean, I ain't trying to really smash either one, really. But that's I mean, fun. I would no, have to fuck with No, the you gotta bitch. pick one. No, fuck that's that. why you exactly. talking long term. Long term, not just yeah, smack. Yeah. I'm very picky. That's why I, I put that in there, so we all win. But I mean, say, I would have to I'm go with the fat girl because I know she got good credit. Exactly. She got shit, that right? part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's not gonna be yeah. fighting that much. Yeah. She don't that got a master's degree. I can't kiss an ugly bitch. My ugly bitch got her degree. Man, what? Is he doing it? No, no, I didn't say that. I said I'm stroking her from the back. I didn't say I'm kissing the bitch. I didn't say I'm kissing her. You can't kiss an ugly bitch. Nah, nah. Three months. Five months, you ain't gonna never kiss her. I don't believe in that. Ah, yeah, you yeah, don't I ain't kiss his girlfriend. I ain't kissing that bitch. I'll be on Drake status. <laughs> My ugly bitch is on probation. I can't be doing that bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck out of here, bitch. Out of jail. I, I got a gun head. charge too, motherfucker. Like what, bitch? Nah, yeah, I, I got do a gun charge. No, yeah. but what about you, Dad? If you going with the thick, ugly I'm going bitch? with the thick. No, I'm going with no. You said thick, pretty bitch. Yeah, don't yeah, play yeah, with. Yeah, hey, no, now no, I gotta yeah. get a thick, ugly bitch. They say you can't get a pretty one. Yeah, this but this looking like Dana Stubblefield. Fat and pretty. She look like. <laughs> she look like Lizzo. I'm with it. She look like Lizzo. I'm, I'm taking down Lizzo. Lizzo. With a Coyle really? Ray face. I'll fuck, man, I'll fuck Lizzo up. Real talk. Yeah. I'm yeah. not I'm not whacking Lizzo. I'm sorry. Off two beers. Lizzo is throwing too much at the I, Laker yeah, game. Yeah, I'm not whacking Lizzo. I'm a Laker and It's not fan. because she fat. Yeah. She just extra out. Okay. Yeah, that's what I mean. She doing too much. Yeah. Lizzo she need cool. To chill. But I wouldn't smack just because not because she big or nothing. Big yeah, bitches yeah, are yeah, She just extra out. I'm tired of he said that shit like he didn't want to get canceled. Like, hey, nigga, nigga, wrong with, no, nothing wrong with no big bitches. Ah, fuck Viola Davis, old ass. So. Yeah. Hey, uh, who <laughs> was it? Oprah. That, wait a minute. I wouldn't who, fuck Oprah. Who I was it that just tripping. got with Cher? Oh, oh that was, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. That yeah. was Amber Rose's uh, fiance. Bro, he uh, went from Amber. Imagine that. Cher yeah. is fine. Nah, Cher. Hey, but how old, young is this dude? And how old is Cher? She, Cher's like seventy six. Cher's like Cher a, seventy eight. Cher had Jesus Cher, in her yearbook. Hey, Cher seventy eight. Uh, oh, I saw her twerking the other that, day. That shit crazy. Whoa. No, yeah, that Cher shit crazy. seventy eight twerking. Yeah. Seventy eight, bro. She about to be eighty. Hey, <laughs> she had on fishnets oh, and all that type of shit. She could be my mermaid all day. Out of Cher. He got the W no matter what. Yeah, he win, bitch. Bro, he about to get the fucking. He about to work his way into that. I mean, you. 
if he yeah, married she Shannon, she got that, but do you think do you think, you think it was because that. maybe he got tired of fucking with ball bitches and slapping her head, and he's like, "Fucking Cher got long ass hair. I'm about to pull this bitch shit." What? Yay! You can't pull. I mean, come on. But Amber Rose is down to throw on a wig. But Amber Rose is bad. Amber Rose is one of the baddest bitches. He probably didn't want to pull it off on accident. You feel me? That yeah, she get mad. But Cher got to take on her dentures. He just got to go back slapping the head. He probably getting gummied out. Can't do that. Ain't nothing wrong with getting gummed down. He probably could you guys go from Cher? From Amber Rose to share? I don't know. I could do whatever. I'm a man. I mean, would you want to? If I was still sleeping on couches, yeah. Personally, if you didn't have the bag, I wouldn't. What you no, mean? no, no, but we're talking bad. They we're talking about bag. share. Oh, share but yeah, just yeah, share yeah. got a bag bag, though. I'll upgrade it. She got old bag. Share got money still from Mermaid. She got the movie. Bono's bag. Um, yeah. <laughs> share got a movie from the Wizard of Oz days. Hey, do you think Share mm, smokes trees? I don't trees? know, man. I, don't yeah, know. I mean, I don't to, know I to fuck with a young dude, yeah. I think so. Sonny Bono, didn't he die from hitting a tree? Yeah. Oh, he did hit the tree. Did you think she hit the tree too hard? Okay, never mind. Man. I'm sorry, Cher. I love you. That's fucked up. Hey, Sonny was like 63 when he was with her at that point. Yeah. Yeah, he was He was checking out. We're in like a hundred right now. <laughs> Damn, that nigga probably He's dead. What are you talking that about? Speaking of, hey. speaking of, uh, like right yeah. speaking of dating you. people nah, older yeah, and, yeah, and yeah, all yeah. that. He would have been crazy. So yeah. the other one, bro, Scotty Pippen, oh. his wife is fucking Michael Jordan's son. He fucked his auntie. That's out of spite. It's fucked his auntie. That's yeah. basically fucking your auntie. Like, yeah. Like he calling you Uncle Scotty. That's probably his godfather. He he been he been praying on her since he was like three years old. Yeah, he might have. So he was he, seven. He was seven when they got, got together. Married. When they got married. Okay, yeah. so he he been praying on her since then. Like he just been looking at her like, yeah, that's gonna be my like, one my day. My auntie dick. Yeah, yeah, she, yeah she got my, ass. my auntie. Okay, okay, yeah. You think it was that, or do you think that it was because him, Michael Jordan, and Pippen been going at it, and he was like. Pops, chill back. I'll go fuck his wife for you. Yeah, then I, I'll, I'll get it on camera. And then we can hey, do if, that, if that's the case, you feel me? Like, because they got beef. Plot twist. Jordan, Jordan already him. fucked, and he told him how it felt. So that he part. Out. He was like, so that pussy ain't shit. He wanted to see what it so was. He wanted to see. He, he said, rolled nah, the dice. she drip, drip. <laughs> she drip. He rolled drip, the drip. dice. Ain't nothing like sharing yeah, pussy with your dad. Um, fuck it. Hey, <clears throat> that's swag. That's that, hey, that's real shit. That's swag. Wild though. That's some hood shit. But nah, yeah, he's sharing with the uncle. Yeah, he that's really damn. That's, that's wild. Imagine how Pippen feels. And if I was Scotty, I would want to fight. I mean, oh, he got to, bro. Yeah. Yeah. But then he got to fight Jordan, too. Uh, Pippen will yeah. fuck Jordan up. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> he will fuck Pippen Jordan, 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 Jordan up. Pippen could afford hey. to fuck one of them young niggas. That the would young be a girlfriend. fire celebrity boxing match. That's true. Hey, Pippen will put hands on that kid like a bad priest. I swear to God, he would. Hey, Pippen got enough money to go find Jordan's son. Jordan's son, ex girlfriend, the girl he loved, and pay her to fuck on her too. Mm. So he could get him back. He could get. He, he could yeah, try. To- Scotty Pippen Jr. is a Laker. He might as well go smash on some of Jordan's yeah, see, pieces. You see, now this is just wow. tit for tat now. Yeah, this ain't going wild. nowhere. I would get signed hey. by Jordan and then def- deface the whole like, company. Oh, Damn. Man. Who you think Scotty Pippen Jr. should get signed by Y'all Jordan? Still holding and grudges. Th- and then nah, and then do some nah, weird nah. shit. Nah. And get the whole company. If he down. signed with Jordan after J- Jordan's, yeah, after his nah, his crazy. mom, espionage he, type shit. Crazy. He's going into the business to rip it up from under. Hey, I didn't even think about that. So that's Scotty Pippen Jr.'s mom. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Bro, he's on the Lakers right now, and Jordan's. Son is over there gutting out his mom. Yeah. Imagine her showing up. Preseason, bitch. Imagine them showing up to the game together. Like, you're be awesome. Come on, baby. You're you're short of the the crowd. His mom's right there with Jordan's kid. That's that's fucking Wearing Jordans. They're both wearing Jordans. Now, that's a new stepdad and shit. Like, that's just crazy. (laughs) Yo, like. They're the same age. Hey, look at her son score. (laughs) You feel me? Look at her son make a layup. Like, that shit crazy. Look at my son. Yeah, look at my son. That's mine. Get back on defense. That shit crazy. I just thought of that. Damn. Yeah, we used to play together when we were that's kids. Together. That's what I'm going to do to your ass when you rapping on the stage. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. That's, no. My, that's my baby brother right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, you know. Damn. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that's that's crazy. the little homie. I wrote half of his rhymes. <laughs> that's the little homie. We spar together. That shit is funny as fuck. I heard these rounds before. It's right. <laughs> I already heard this shit on the way here. It's gonna be fire. Hey, he would you like Danny Myers and Cassidy? <laughs> I heard this round before. <laughs> That's funny. Hey man, Cass man, Cass man, how you feel about Cass in the battle rap world, man? Oh, um, mm. yeah, he should just quit. Mm. Man, his time no. has passed already. His last battle was fire, bro. Don't lie. 
He did better. Yeah, he did better. He's graduating. He's, he's still he's three in a row lost. I yeah, mean, but the he, third yeah. battle, he had conviction in that battle. I liked it. Who was that Hitman, man, right? Yeah, the last one was. But he lost. He lost. He but still I, lost, too. I yeah. liked his, his rounds. Arsenal murdered. Time. Goods murdered. Man, I look at him beating him, man, though. I, I, I was in the Captain middle. Hitman? Yeah, he's yeah, right. You're because, right. You're because, right. Like, you're right. Yeah, you're right. You're yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. Hitman didn't have a good performance like, that like, He didn't. He didn't no, because he, didn't. He, he said something about he, he makes shit slide land or some shit he like that. He didn't even that do a, um, what's, what's this shit? The remix. Yeah. He yeah. even yeah. said it like, um, damn, I didn't even get to He did the Mario Kart shit. And then he ended this round, but as he ended it, he said, Oh, the shells. I didn't even get to do my remix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mario Kart shit. Yeah, the shells shit. And then Cassidy shit. Was trash when he started getting into the like your teeth so big type shit like that was kind of weird. <laughs> yeah. Well, because so, like, I mean the wild and out type shit, he yeah, kind of take yeah, that yeah. approach. Everybody yeah. always talking about his And then I was like, that's just not the right approach. But yeah, I mean, um, I like Cassidy better when he battled Goods. You feel me? I had a beating Goods, low key. Mm. Did you really? Yeah, uh, I yeah, did. I had to be. I, I'm not really a fan of Goods. I, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm not a fan of Goods either. Yeah, that, really? that slick, yeah, that slick talk shit is one of my favorite rappers. Nah, that slick talk shit is not like. See, like with Goods. He has that slick talk, but like, that's not know, fire. It's just not fire. No. Yeah, the slick talk ain't fire. Yeah, it's that's like crazy. some of the shit he I says think is that's cool. Fire. No, but, that's just flexing uh, on your opponent. That's yeah. not really fire. You can have a round or it's, some bars. It's because though it's not it's not just what he's saying. It's how he says it. Like like that how little, you say uh people with conviction like. You know, like Geechee, you believe mm. what he says when he yeah, says it. Like, uh, you know what I mean? But you believe Goods when he says what he said. Like, right. he, like at the end of the day, all he's saying is like, I'm flyer than you. At the end of the day, yeah. you're going to go home you and I'm going to go home me. I'm winning already. I'm getting money regardless. And it's believable because he really is. So. He's not winning a battle for that. I'm sorry. He could gain popularity. Yeah, that guy's bars, though. I can like yeah, him as a he human. Does it, he does it in a fly way. Against, he does. Against I like, people I with no with goods. bars. Me too. Against, against people with no bars, goods will prevail with that slick talk shit. But if you put mm. goods against somebody like Rum Nitty, the slick talk is, is going to bounce off Nitty. I He's going to be talking bars. about bars. I mean, it, it, it just, you gotta, it you all depends on, yeah, it all depends on my boy, what style of rap you like, you like the metaphorically shit, you like the fucking schemes, you like punchlines, you like, mm -hmm. everybody has their own favorite rapper, to where mm -hmm. it's like, okay, I like this, so when In you put style. two different styles up against somebody, it's kind of hard to judge, because right. it's like, damn, they both did their shit, I was just their own style. I was just exactly. watching um, Piper like, Boy this morning, and he was saying, being a fan of a battle rapper fucks it up because, like you just said, mm -hmm. you got your own mix. It's not fair to the actual battle. Right. Because you're yeah. going to be saying, my boy won Bias. regardless. Yeah. And that's a lie. Just like the argument earlier with me and you. I said, Jazz got that ass. You said, no. You said, Assassin got it. Yeah. I said, no, she didn't. But Jazz even, got that ass. But even, man, one, another battle rapper said, Vixen yeah. won. I'm sorry. One, yeah, yeah. First and I the third. Vixen but I had, first I, and third. All first I heard third. from everybody was uh, Jazz. Uh, the second, Jazz everybody said well, Jazz see, won, too. See, like, I have a lot of people from New York, like, and they hate when I say Vixen won. They hate when I say Geechee almost beat Mook. Mook just knew who to write for. He wrote for the New York crowd. You crazy. Yeah. Geechee did not Geechee almost didn't do Mook. his shit, not, though. Not, not, not he wasn't, a, not he wasn't because, on his A. Not because, like, Geechee in the second round, I had him beat Mook. Bro, 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 bro. But, but, but in that, second in round, that, but, it was a 2-1. But in that first, but everybody saying Mook 30 to him. That's no, what I'm no, 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 like, no, no, no. They didn't look, say that. It was 2-1. Yeah, look, look, yeah. Look, look, yeah. Look, look. But a lot of people. It wasn't like, up there. Watch, watch, watch Piper sure. Boy, bro. Yeah, a lot of watch people in, uh, a lot of people in New York, you feel me? Yeah. Well, they, I mean, that's they, the, oh, that's yeah, the New saying, you feel I get me? it. But, but I was like, nah, Geechee got the second, you feel me? But Geechee, you can, you can argue the second. You can argue the second. I'm not giving Geechee the second, but as a Geechee fan, if you want to argue the second, I'll give you that. Yeah. But he lost. He lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He lost. He lost 2-1. Definitely. You said but, almost beat Mook. Don't word it like that because he lost terribly. <laughs> Sorry. It, you can argue the 30 if you want to that be That first asshole. round, that first round, the only reason why Mook won because he, he got 30. sturdy. I can say that. It was 2 1. Yeah, he could, you can't say he was 30. I, I don't believe he Mook, was 30. Mook at all. got sturdy. And he barely won Mook, that second Mook, round. Mook got sturdy. Exactly. He barely won the second. Mook got sturdy for the first round. And, and that's he called what he out that first. No, and he called because out. Because that's sir. when everybody started going crazy. And he called and out. And he said, sir. easy, and they ended the and round. And the round. Yeah, he did yeah. win. So, so he if, he didn't do the, if he didn't do the but sturdy. That's performance. Don't he, take away from his. He might have lost that. Nah, you can't say if he didn't rebuttal or if he didn't 
do some performance shit. That's think, what you have to but do. But think if he did that in like LA. If he didn't have bars, Atlanta, he would have lost. Like, yeah, that's true. Atlanta, I mean, everybody yeah. would, with no bars. What the fuck? That mean, shit's out. He did in Virginia. You know, that yeah. shit wouldn't hit. But everybody got to dance. So technically, you still not right. Because if I learned the, the culture of that state, I could pull out that. Okay, maybe, that maybe Atlanta. Maybe yeah. Atlanta. Maybe mm-hmm. Atlanta. Because that's like a state that, that really like fucks with the dance culture. But, but at, at, at the end of the day, bro, whatever venue you are at, you're going to write for the venue. That's but he lost. He lost Mook. He yeah, lost, come on, but he lost, yeah. you can't take but, away but from do, me. But I do agree. I did he, did, he did lose Mook. I do agree. Because he that was the best. That, that was the best Mook I've seen exactly. in a couple years. I don't even like Sess, Mook. That's the Tay Rock shit. That was the best Mook I've seen. Nah, I didn't even like Mook versus Tay Rock. But yeah. I, ain't gonna, I didn't get into that. I'm not yeah. a Mook fan, but Mook did amazing, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm not even. Nah, he did. He did amazing, but but. You over here talking about you really a Geechee fan? You talking about if he didn't perform? Okay, he's go. West Coast. He's not a I'm not a Geechee fan. I'm not a Geechee fan. That's I'm just, not fair I'm to just, say though. I'm just more West. Bro, you me, but, you want, more West. But if you won a rap battle because you outperformed your opponent, it's because and of then styles. You went on a podcast and said so, if he didn't perform better than me, he would have lost. So right now, yeah, well, that's right the whole now, point. Guess what? <laughs> but right now, you feel me? Like. I have a chance to say Geechee trash and all this shit because nah, he's been, he been, he been, he been, te- he been telling me. We got caffeine nah, right nah, now. Don't nah, do that. No, nah, nah, I'm just saying because he's been telling me I'm trash my whole career. You feel me? So mm. I could say that. So that's yeah. not me saying I'm a Geechee fan. I'm just calling it as I see it. Like, yeah, he did get closer to what people are saying. It wasn't a 30. That's all I'm saying. People are saying no, it's, no. it's a. You can argue the second. You can argue the second. You can try. You can argue. That's, what, that's all I'm saying. Yeah. It's, it's not a clear. 30. 30. That's all I'm saying. It's not a clear 30. It wasn't saying, even a gentleman's 30. Or whatever. It's a That's little bit saying. less than a gentleman's, but, but it's close to a gentleman's, but it's less than. But for the record, get you in trash. I'm just saying, <laughs> I could have said that because Dope. he's been saying that Dope. my whole Dope. career. You feel me? But other than that, like, um, yeah, Geechee lost to Mook, but I still think Vixen beat Jazz. Vixen beat Jazz for sure. The on the road podcast. Home. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Jazz, Your boy TC, Jazz God K. Man, we live right one. here on Caffeine. Real Dude, talk, real talk, my boy in the building. Let's go, let's go. Yes, sir. Shout outs to Caffeine, you know what I'm saying? We got my boy Dr. Dandruff in the building. Is that yes, me? Sir. That's you. Face tattoo. Celebrity stylist, God K. God K in the building. This man won the motherfucking boat. Hey, the building, let's battle go. rap is fine, this baby. Yeah, we in the building. Facts, yes, facts, sir. Facts. Dandruff right here. Y'all stay tuned. Let's do it. Yes, sir. <clears throat> the Honor Roll Podcast. Let's keep it going, though. So, um... Vixen and, and Jazz. Vixen yeah, and Jazz. Um, jazz could have said anything in that battle, and they would have went crazy. She was I saying felt that. anything. Well, it's like home court she was home saying court anything. Home court of first round, she was okay, saying it's anything. Kinda, it's, I guess you could say it, it would be kind of like the Mook shit, but it's not, because Mook actually was rapping and saying bars that anywhere that it could have hit. You feel me? Right. Jazz right. was saying anything about New York. <laughs> they start reacting. Vixen crazy. said something crazy, crazy and, nobody and nobody went with crickets and I was I was, I was like sad. this is crazy. First of all, Jazz cannot spit basketball bars when she's been telling us for years she does not watch basketball. You know what I'm saying? Right. Oh, why did like that? Why did I tell you? I mean, but at the end of the day, it's like, I mean, yeah, Jazz had the fucking crowd. She had the crowd, but my boy she had yeah, yeah. She, she was spitting. imitated the bitch. She even fucking hit her where it hurt to where she was talking about her exes and this and that. Like, I mean, she she was hitting below the belt, dog, on some real shit. And her stage performance is way fucking better than old girl walking around with her fat ass. No, that that ain't that don't that don't mean shit. That don't mean shit, my boy. At the end of the day. Hey, 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 hey. I hate when female battle rappers talk about girls. So bad. like, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's but, not like, bars. But like, um. Nah, uh, I think somebody wrote for Jazz in that in that Ooh, round. Talk where, about it. Whoever it did, fucking it. it they start. The they start saying about like she started using basketball bars, like Middleton and Oladipo. She does not know who the fuck that is. I don't <laughs> care. She does not watch basketball. She's been telling us for years. And the fact that Luke Castro was reacting before she even react, like set those bars. Like, right. You know what I'm saying. I just feel like her using those bars. I, I don't really feel like she won because so she you used think those bars, you think but, pretty um, much because the bars were suspect as to her writing them because she don't have the knowledge of basketball to say someone like Oladipo. Yeah, That's such a flip. Yeah, you would like, have to really be a fan of of uh, basketball to know that. It wasn't a regular flip. Like yeah, she it was more like the, just the news. Yeah. Like like 
give Vix the heat. Over, like, come on, man. Yeah. Like, yeah, come it, on, it was yo. more basic. Yeah, it was yeah. more just like oh, It was an intricate shit. bar. Obvious. Yeah, it was some intricate shit. It, it was kind of like, if, if it was, if she didn't say the Middleton bar after, I would have been probably let that go. But she said the Middleton bar too. And there was like, yeah, you you doing too much right there. Yeah, it was, yeah but like, but yeah, like, um. I feel like the whole the whole Jazz and Vixen battle, Vixen won that one. You feel me? It could be debated though. I mean, it could be debated. So what do you, you got know, it? What do you got it? Like what? I two got one? I got Vixen first round first and, and third. third. Yeah. So two yeah, one. Vixen I agree. First and third. First and third. Mm. I mean, what else I, was on that card? It was uh, it was uh, who else was on there? We had uh, so I tuned. Oh, in we had uh, oh the new fools the, 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 the uh, stumbles and stumbles. Kid Slay. stumbles and Kid Slay. Uh, uh, Stumbles okay. choked Kid, Kid Slade, Kid Slade got that ass. Okay, uh, mm. shout out Kid Slade. You feel me? R three. You feel me? Like he's an R three with me. Um, yeah, man, he cooked. I mean, he thirty stumbles. Oh, mm. yeah, he did. Uh, stumbles, stumbles. I, I stumbles in the first was, round. Shooting though, in I the heard. first round. Yeah. Okay. So, some shit. so stumbles had a line that was crazy. Yep. He said he goes to funerals just to hug bitches. Because you know, no, no, oh yeah, no, yeah. Just he because said, he likes to hug bitches. He said, he said, I'll, I'll, I'll plug a, I'll, I'll plug a phone charger on your fucking casket because I, I heard there's a plug in it or something. Yeah, I heard there's a plug like, in oh. it. Yeah, like he was cooking, but um, stumble, stumble. You feel me? Like it, stumble, it just, stumble. He came out hard. Does he, get, does he get a pass stumbling because his name is Stumbles? Like, does he? Get a, no, he just lived up to his that, name. He lived up to <laughs> no. his name. That's funny. It goes like, no, no. <laughs> like, I mean, people we get, told me Swamp beat ours. That's uh, crazy. Yeah, he beat ours, but Whoa, that was, but that was the that was the worst Swamp and ours I ever seen. All right, I'm about mm. to watch that because I don't. That battle was. I'm horrible. tired of Swamp winning battles uh, this year. What the fuck I'm is going this. on? Swamp is trash. Swamp's been going. I'm I don't say like this, Swamp though. at all. I'm a Swamp hater. I'm gonna say Sorry. this crazy. though. Swamp beat Rum. Uh, oh, that's right. that's you right. Yeah, I'm, Swamp been going yeah, in yeah, yeah. though. I'm yeah, not gonna Swamp, argue that. Swamp beat Rum. Swamp beat Rum. Swamp run. And he beat Rock. No, he didn't. He didn't beat Tay Rock because Rock choked. You feel me? Rock yeah, didn't yeah, choke. He said, that, he said that bullshit ass raccoon bar and got booed. That's why he lost, not the choke. He, he, he said okay, that, he lost. He said everybody. Uh, they start booing out of nowhere. He didn't, nowhere he didn't that, know but, that but. everybody uh, from, from, from South Carolina eat raccoons. He thought only Swamp <laughs> ate raccoons. So he shitted on people who eat raccoons and then everybody That's true. booed him. Is that real? People really, you guys really. Eat I, I would not eat a fucking raccoon. I don't I eat know. Turtle soup. That's People like eating a fucking pie. No, I heard a turtle soup, so, which is uh, wild too. I, a turtle right. soup is good for when you have a hangover. So yeah, so like, <laughs> but yeah, that, <laughs> you did that. That wasn't a good battle. That's I seen better fire. from both. I seen better from both right, from Mars and up. Swamp. Um, whoa, whoa, wait, how did he beat him? A thirty swamp thirty Arsenal? Or you no, no, it wasn't. It wasn't no thirty. It wasn't no thirty. It, it was kind of a bad battle on either so, side. So, so it's in, like, in, in what context did Mook this? I mean, did okay, Arse it could be. Mook? It could be debated. The Arse and the swamp battle. It could be debated to one either way. Did but, you hear what Arse said about Mook's mom at the end? Um, because <laughs> Mook did an interview about it. Yeah, yeah, it 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 wasn't really that that horrible. It's Arse. Like, it, but he's it, not battling Mook. But, like but he's not battling mom. Mook. But but he disses dead. Up. But he disses dead mom. So like, I feel for Mook. You feel me? Yeah. But I, I feel for him because like, now it's past battle rap. It's like I don't want to battle no more. Yeah. Like if that was me, I wouldn't want to battle no more. I'll be like, nah, let's you just fade and yeah, do yeah, whatever. You it's the same. Me? It's the same as yeah. what Mook did. Mook did that shit to new what new new nails and shit. Remember shit? That yeah. was wild. Yeah. Fucking Beastie and all that shit. Hey, like, hey, that was crazy. And she had a like interview and shit afterwards. When he said Nunu could get AIDS and all this shit, that I said, out. whoa. Bro, that was wild. I said, that is wild. That because, was like, wild. Yeah, that's wild. But, you know, they get disrespectful and then they can't take you when somebody dishes out to them. You feel me? Yeah. That's battle rap. Battle I mean, that's rappers battle. are sensitive. You, yeah, you, you signed up for that. I butt. think everything is, is, is all right in battle rap except dead people. I don't think yeah. you're talking about Yeah, the you can't do that. Yeah, like, um, other than that, anything is like is, your dad's a rat, like Charlie Clips yeah, and all, all that, that shit. shit. That's cool. That's facts. But there's only a few person that can't yeah, defend themselves. Or a kid. Like, that shit's yeah. out. There's yeah. probably only a few people that I'll go that far with in battle rap. Ooh, and why is that? <laughs> Damn. Explain. Just because I want them to press that line outside of battle rap. Oh, you oh, oh, so it's personal. Um, yeah, all right. It, so maybe that's New, what happened. In New York, I ain't gonna lie. Ladies and gentlemen, hey, we don't promote yeah, that shit right yeah, here. Not at this podcast. Exactly. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. But no, nah, like, um, you know, um, you know, people like Dizzy Spades, you know, in New York, you know, people like him. I might push that line with him. 
Mm. Uh, you know, but he need to come out west because he he relied, <laughs> he relied I mean, on New York too much. But man. everybody like, knows battle rap has the best community. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can like, link up. There's no, there's no violence though. States, there's no violence from different colors and all that, and nothing happens at our mm. events. You like, heard it best, never. baby, right here. Battle rap events never. don't go bad re- realistically never. compared to other events. Never. Like if um if there is a problem, like <clears throat> we always say, just take it around the corner, handle it, and then come back. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. work. I yeah, mean, I mean, um, what do you guys do? You guys go around like to, like around the corner or, and battle or, rap, or just set it up? <laughs> you guys practice this shit like, hey, no, 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 like uh, I want the coin toss, motherfucker. Like, like say, like say, or we you all fight. Say they have a problem online, you feel me? But we don't want to really fuck up the event. We just tell them, hey, oh, don't me around the corner. We catch the fade, shake hands, and then we come back. Oh, that's cool. And, and ain't but, not one motherfucker with yeah, a video camera like, like uh, these arsenal, these oh, fire no. daylight. I don't. Shoot. It's it's been video like camera. People, I don't it's like been. people messing yeah. up events, swinging on people at events. Like I don't Math condone Huffle. that. Like they do yeah. at baseball. I don't condone that. Disaster at uh, Math Huffle. Like they do at uh, in, in, yeah. In league the, owners like a uh, conclusion. Crazy. Oh, you mad because I'm styling on you? Hey, not like. <laughs> like league, league owners like conclusion is smooth. They put a lot of money into this. Yeah, and you're fucking you, up their money. You fuck up their money. Yeah, like so. I have a problem with that. I'm gonna get me? you. So you're like right. I'll really get down with somebody over that. You that's feel facts. me? Because like these are the homies and they really trying to do something. No, yeah. that's real. So, that's um, respect. That's respect. So like. Smooth is actually my homie. Like past battle, rap. I don't even really look at it as a battle rap homie. You feel me? Like you feel me? Uh, we have a song together and shit. Like so we about yep. to we about to do it up. You feel me? Right. But yeah, like. This whole, like, um, yeah, I'll push the line with Dizzy Spades. I'll push the line with, like, a couple of his people. But and then now on the West, the West is family to me. So That's right. I so, do what if, thing, like, so what if we were to set up uh, battle rap boxing matches? Be because cool. I do have a, a boxing gym I work with. Shout out to my boy, uh, Andrew Stafford. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Professional boxer. He got a gym. And it's in Calabasas, fly shit. Okay. I'm like a this trainer was too. where we were gonna. Uh, uh-huh. I'm a trainer. Yeah. This is where we were gonna yeah. do a uh, Crip Max uh, boxing match. Oh, okay. Really? That's okay. cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I was the one actually behind the scenes, oh. locking a lot so of shit gonna, in. Uh, box. Okay. Um, well, me? so it switched up a few times, like. Nope. Huh? No, it started with one guy. It started with one guy. I forget his name. It was just on some street shit, like a mm. guy that called him out on right. Clubhouse and whatever. So they were gonna do that, but then it ended up like. Switching people like it went to Blueface at one point. Blueface it went fire to, shit up. Um, uh, but I said it right here in this podcast. He's a he's a big guy though too. He's tall, yeah. No, no, no. Blueface well, I mean, said just jab him up yeah, and well, stay away he's from tall, him. He got length. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah he, he would have to yeah, just jab yeah. him up, keep his distance. That's and, easy. My and boy and would be tired in, in thirty seconds. Facts. Real talk. But if he does rush him and throw a crazy one, like if he don't respect those jabs coming in, takes a couple and just he might be hurt. <laughs> Oh, yeah. bro, he could. He might be hurt. There's a, there's he, a weight difference. Weight difference. He's gonna put yeah, it down. Yeah, there's a weight difference, bro. If he could this just get inside, UFC, if he could get inside one, and get one, you get out. That. You yeah. out. Yeah. It's like Mike Tyson fighting a dog. <laughs> dog <laughs> can bite him a few times, but he gonna bite him back <laughs> right in the ear. Right, right in, in the, the ear. ear. <laughs> he gonna bite him back. Oh yeah, shout out Mike Tyson. <laughs> Facts. Him and, uh, the edibles. Field. They got, got the edibles. That, that yeah. Ear, the ear edibles. Yep. Shout out. That's hey, crazy. that is fire. That's, That's crazy. Beast. Shout out Hot Boxing. Hey, hot Boxing with Mike Tyson. You got a question. So, if Mike Tyson came up to you, I'm running. Called you out for a fade. Would you take it? Shit. Shit. <laughs> I don't know. Well, Mike Tyson's so stupid. Say, you can probably you just say, sneak nah, your way in. I don't want the smoke. And then, like, nah, if I'm faded, walk into a restaurant. With my bitch, and then I bump into him, and he's trying to squabble. I probably wouldn't squabble, yeah, because I'm high, uh, yeah, I'm yeah, my girl. Yeah, but if it's yeah. on some other shit, like maybe uh, yeah. exercising at Venice Beach or something, and he says some weird shit, I might try to squabble and get beat up. Just throw yeah. some sand in his face. No, nah, I, I just might try to squabble with him because hey, get the fuck out of here. Anybody's trying hey, to squabble. Hey, yeah, I might just try to squabble. I'm gonna do try I'm to I'm gonna do anything to win. Jesus Christ, I'm not gonna try to squabble him. But that's a better scenario to get me to fight him. Yeah, there you go. It would have to really piss I'm you off. I'm gonna turn it down most of the time. I'm gonna turn but it down. <laughs> but there's other scenarios where I just might get beat up. On I'm gonna turn it down. I'm gonna go viral. Uh, I'm gonna be like, fight, I'm bro, I'm fight. Nah, I want to take a picture for him. Got knocked out. We take a speech. Man, I'll, I'll, I'll know, like, nah, that one dude put a gun on him that one time when he was trying oh, to just at be the a fan. comedy story. Yeah, I mean, oh, yeah, at the comedy. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, yeah, weirdo. Yeah, the performance. Yeah, what was it at? I forgot. I think it was. Was in Hollywood. I think it was in Hollywood. Yeah, and he didn't say shit. 
You know what I'm saying? He didn't even flinch. His hands is registered. He's like, so he come here, man. Come here, up. man. Give me a hug. Oh, yeah, God yeah. He took a picture with him and all that. I was like, motherfucker. It's obvious you're going through some things. Come here. Come here. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? This motherfucker. You sound like Mike Tyson. You That's know, fucked. Well, I mean, but yeah, we, we both haven't went through puberty. <laughs> <clears throat> you know, Mike Tyson just meaner. And, and then he said he was that mean because, you know, like, because he was afraid. That's what Tyson said. Like, I mean, because I watch hot boxing. Shout out to hot boxing with Mike Tyson. Facts. And uh, he, he really said that, you know, like he would knock people out that quick because he was afraid. Like, you know, like he wouldn't give them a chance mm. to yeah. fuck with you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just bang, bang, boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm saying? You got to get that first one off and just, that's it. I ain't going to lie. He said he learned how to fight because he was a bully. That, that like, too. Yeah, that that's too. That's crazy. Yeah, that's you feel crazy. Me? Like, and now he's the bully. No, I'm playing. <laughs> no, I'm playing. That nigga old as hell, still Don't. knocking shit out. Yeah, yeah, he is still knocking some shit out. Don't take that in He fought Roy Jones. Remember when he, with that Roy Jones fight? I didn't see that. We recently had a Roy Jones fight. I was scared as fuck. I was scared for both Roy. of them. I yeah, thought, facts, but I, thought you were I was going scared break. for Roy. I thought you were going to break that's his what, body, bro. Like, mm, those body shots he was giving out there. I said, come on now, Roy. You know, Roy's, Roy's some crafty some though. YouTube, yeah. I, didn't, I didn't get to watch Roy, Roy is one of my favorite fighters. I mean, That's Roy, why I'm scared yeah, for him. Definitely. Look at both he's of their flashy. careers though. Roy Jones is flashy. Yeah, he's flashy, yeah, but look at both of their fighters. careers though. His agility is crazy, but like Mike Tyson's, bro, his power punches, bro, like oh, yeah, man, one facts. punch could just knock the air out of him. The guy walks around 230, 235, 240, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, Roy Jones. But look at where Roy Jones went from. He went from this weight class yeah, all middle. the way up. He all went the from way up. middle all that the way was to a different weight. That was a different yeah. weight class. Like, that That just wasn't yep. fair. Not a lot of people do that shit. <laughs> nope. Yeah. And become champions. No one. He was, the, he was the only one. He became heavyweight champion. Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, dang. Facts. No. Middleweight to heavyweight. That's all right, we're wild. We're talking boxing now. We're talking boxing now. I got a I question. Boxing. Who's holding it down right now? Uh, fucking Earl Spence Jr. Number Earl one. Spence, well, I mean, after Facts. the car accident and all that shit, he's been whooping. Yeah, ass. He's been doing it right. No Shout out to Texas, man. real talk. Roy Jones. Dallas, I mean, Texas. Um, Earl Spence. Yeah, that's my guy. Yeah, been the truth. Guy. The truth. Yeah, I called it. Uh, like, fuck, so long ago. I think probably like 2015 on I've been um, watching him too. 14 mm -hmm. on um Twitter, and he retweeted me. I said he's the future champion, and then he became champion like five years later. Or something after truth. I tweeted that's it right. four years later. I've been I've been knew it too. That guy's yeah. great. Yeah, I got his autograph on the T-shirt. All that shit. Real. What about Javante Tank Davis? My guy too. I got Javante his glove Tank. and his t and his poster signed. Yeah. Baltimore, no. Yep. Shout out Baltimore. What's what that? about these yeah. celebrity boxing matches? Y'all been fucking well, with that this? That shit's sad. So, so Mayweather just had Javante one, Tank Davis. You have seen that? They said Whoa. January with, with Ryan. Uh, oh, with ooh, with Ryan Garcia. With Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia in Ryan January. Gar Ryan supposedly. Garcia's gonna get his little fucking shit combed to the side, knock the fuck, knocked. But then again, but Ryan Garcia's dance, tall though. though. Yeah, he's gonna he's dance. Tall. He's gonna get him. He's gonna dance. We we haven't seen no one dance on. I don't know, Javante. That's a at rough all. one. That's a rough one for me. But Javante just needs to land. He'll eat a few. We seen what he did already. But uh, he doesn't have no. We we all seen him get rocked by fucking yeah. uh, what's his name, uh, Cruz. Mm -hmm. He well, didn't even want to rematch with Cruz. Yeah, with Isak Pitbull. Cruz. Yeah, yeah Pitbull. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he didn't even want to rematch with him. If they would have did a rematch, Isak Isak probably would have got that ass. Yeah, that was a mm. close fight. That yeah. was a close that was a fight. Good one. I think but I, I think even think Javante, Javante lost. By, I don't know, bro. I think Javante lost, my boy. I some real know. shit. It was real close, but the champion has to, you know, they got to win. I mean, the, the challenger has to knock the champion out. Yeah, you have to don't just give it, beat Don't him. leave it into the hands yeah. of the judges. Not yeah, never. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I give you that. Definitely got to beat the champion. You watch boxing, my boy? Who you fuck with? No, I don't really watch oh. boxing. Canelo, like nobody? My boy, no. nobody. I haven't watched boxing in a minute, but I used yeah, to watch it back in the day. Yeah, like, I haven't really oh, watched I'm, it in a minute. Recently, I haven't been in Yeah. Facts. I used to watch all the pay per views. Hell yeah! I saw when um, Oscar De La Hoya got. Oh my up. god, he's Oscar De La Hoya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He went to Oscar. Yeah. See, the, he like that's my era. By, uh, that's when I used Mayweather. to watch. Uh, you feel know me? Like when I was younger, the Golden Boys and shit. You feel mm. me? Like, <laughs> yeah, I was like a Winky Wright fan, and a Winky Wright was dope. <laughs> I used, play, I, I used to play Fight Night and all that. Uh, uh, Marco Santonio yeah, Barrera. Fight Night 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 I got those. Uh, the, the, I got the trilogy on DVD. Oh, it's always Roy Jones Jr. Though. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, Barrera. Always, always Roy Jones. Or Pacquiao, uh, Marcos Antonio yeah, Barrera, and uh, Morales. Yeah, oh, yeah, when he was, was just good. like that. I got the you trilogy. Just you with that one. Morales and Pacquiao yeah. was good too. I mean, uh, 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 what's his name? Uh, uh, oh boy, they got knocked out by Pacquiao. What's his name? Uh, uh, which oh, one, Ricky Hatton? No, 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 no. Why well, Ricky Hatton got knocked oh, out? I fucked with Hatton back in the no, day. No, no, I'm talking about Pacquiao and uh, and uh, Marquez. 
Oh, Marquez. Yeah, Marquez. Yeah. That, that Juan, was it. Four Juan, fights. Yeah. Juan Manuel Juan Marquez. Manuel. Yes. Yeah. Shout out my boy, man. That motherfucker right there. That was a good one. He, in the first fight, he got his nose broke in the first round. Damn. Got knocked down three times and came back to get a draw. That's Damn. how good that fight was. Yeah. That fight was fucking awesome. On some real yeah. shit, but, you know, I don't want to bore the fans if you guys don't want to talk boxing, but <laughs> I, I got to ask my boy one question. Greatest boxer of all time. And why? I mean, and why? I don't really. I mean, I, I would have to go with uh, what, what Floyd. Really? Floyd? No, yeah, any any weight class. I would have to go with Floyd, Floyd than to be one thousand, huh? Yeah. Well, Muhammad because Ali. I mean, Muhammad Ali got tested a lot, bro. He lost right. a lot. You That's know true. what I mean? Fools pretend, but the thing is, he beat a, a lot of the people that he lost to more than they beat him. But he lost a lot, bro. Like he was losing to Ken Norton. You know what I mean? Right. He was losing to a lot of people. Like so, Floyd Mayweather never did that, and he's still beaten. He just won again recently. Like he's still. Yeah. Knocking people out. I knew that was a, some goofy shit, but yeah, he still, still whooped his ass. Like, it's still. I mean, Floyd has got to be fake. one of the best. It's got to be. That was fake to me, bro. I the mean, celebrity it's, match. it's not fake. It's just. I a see where joke. he's going, though. You it's know a what? joke. Because Floyd wins with defense. Yeah, you know Floyd what I'm saying. I mean, a, a, he, a good pun, a, he's a good boxer is somebody hit. that doesn't want to get hit. He's gotten hit less than anyone, of course, ever round course. for round. And defense wins championships. So that's, defense that's wins everything. Like that's a good one. So I would have to, yeah. Floyd has to be the yeah, go. I might, I might have to go with motherfucking. Uh, I like Ray. Uh, Sugar Ray Robinson, man. That's mm. Some real shit. I don't, yeah, that's why I knew you were gonna. How'd I don't debate that. How'd you know that? Because I mean, if you know boxing, Sugar Ray Robinson is definitely gonna probably be. And the guy pick. didn't even want to box; like he was broke. Sugar Ray yeah, Robinson, but yeah. and went a hundred and something undefeated. Yeah. Like, are you serious? It's fucking crazy. You know what I'm saying? So it but, was pretty dope. I mean, but then we, gotta, in the ring we too. gotta also remember the the level of skill people had back then compared to who like Floyd was fighting. Man. Floyd really fought like people try to say he didn't like he was a cherry picker, but he fought more champions than anyone and he fought like a lot of fucking people, like yeah, a he lot fought of some, he fought some good motherfuckers. He you know? fought a lot of people. That list is crazy. Mm-hmm. Mosley, Pacquiao. I mean, Floyd was cherry fucking picking all the way. Floyd down. was cherry picking. A lot of people say he runs. He don't run. He, he was cherry picking. Nah, he was. He, was he perfected the art. Madonna. He, he he did fuck. what? Floyd okay, is great. Floyd but he was pretty picking. much came behind Sweepy. Feel me. Sweet peas. Rest in peace, yes. Pernell Whitaker. Yeah, so Pernell that was Whittaker my other dope. favorite. Like he was my favorite was before crazy. him. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like my favorites are like Pernell Whitaker, Pernell Whitaker Roy Jones dope. Jr., and Floyd you Mayweather. You like motherfuckers that are, are quick on their feet? Jr. Yeah, I like the, the, the perfectionists, the angles, the, the, the dancers. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the, like a, like a, the boxers. I like a boxer. Lomachenko. I learned how to fight from. Roy Jones Jr. <laughs> the uh, nah, I don't Lomachenko like Lomachenko. Stupid nah, angles. I actually yeah, called, I called uh, Theofimo beating him like before. I don't like him. I think he's hype. Um, I, Bob Arum, I don't really like. 370-something fights? Amateur fights? That was amateur, bro. And he, only he was a grown-ass man beating up on little kids. Hell <laughs> nah. He was an amateur, bro. too. No, he was an amateur, you too. Really he was like, like 34 Lomachenko. or something. The Matrix is He dope. was an amateur, too. He was like 33, 34 <laughs> years old. <laughs> bro, he was literally beating up 18, up. 19, bullying, 20 year olds. He was, kids. Was he was beating up. the shit out. Bro, that's a fucked up thing. Like, that's the worst <laughs> stat ever. He did ever. go fucking pro at no 30. Yes, he did. That's fucked up. Where's our fact checker? My boy, my fact checker. Come on. Siri, man. when did Loma Machenko turn professional like boxer? 28. <laughs> no, bro. He was in it like 30 years old. In 2013, he made his professional debut. Yeah, because he was only four fights in before he became a champ. Yeah. Yeah. And they gave it to him because of his, uh, yeah. you know, his amateur career. But. Yeah. They gave it to him because he won fair and square. No, bro. No, no. They, are, hey, fight. You always they know are, booms, bro. You they always erased. Know. They erased one of his wins. They acted like he didn't lose his first loss. ESPN don't even be putting that loss on there. That shit is crazy. Uh, it's rigged. Now nah, Bob crazy. Arum's a motherfucker. They hyped this shit up. Mm-hmm. Right. Bob Arum's a motherfucker. I want to see him go up against Ryan or or uh, Shakur or Devin Shakur Haney. Fuck I think some all shit of up. them whoop his ass. Stevenson fucks some shit I up. I think dog. all of them whoop his ass. What's even the kid from uh, Australia that that uh, Haney just lost to that beat Theofimo? Um, Haney didn't lose. Ha- no, that Haney beat. I mean, uh, yeah, that's um, uh, um twice. Gambosis or, or Gam- Gam- yeah, I think I Gambosis, mean, uh, Gambosis, yeah, yeah. I think even he beats uh, Loma Machenko. Fuck no, I think so, bro. <laughs> Hell nah. The way he beat up Theo, but Theo, 
his game plan was wrong. No, Machigo didn't even he lose He thought he was like going to knock though. him out in one round. And he gassed himself. He did. He gassed himself. Gassed himself he got in knocked three on the first down. He got knocked down yeah, on the first round for his first, his first knockdown of his career. He got knocked mm-hmm. down. Y'all, y'all UFC fans too? Hell yeah. I mean, I watch it now, but I'm, I'm an old school UFC fan. Yeah. Silva, fucking I just watched Frank Mayer. Anderson Silva was my guy, but he just got he beat just up. He just got beat up by Paul. Yeah. That? yeah, that's what The motherfucker's how old? He was uh, 47, I think. Come on, 47, my yeah. boy. He was great in his nah, prime. Nah, you see, you see, see you he barely UFC. got hit. The motherfucker was 17. And then he just like, he just Fail. like fell down. Yeah, like, that was cap. And then, and then he got pushed again. Jake Paul paid him like, for that knockout. That I'm was out. I'm like, yo, come on, yo, like. Yeah, it looks fake it as hell. Jake Paul it just wasn't, that. That's bullshit. It wasn't scripted correctly, you feel me? Uh-huh. <laughs> they, they, yeah, they, yeah. Needed, they needed to yeah, rehearse bro. that a little bit they more. He was bad <laughs> acting. Yeah, that was <laughs> terrible. <laughs> they missed rehearsing it Wednesday. They already, <laughs> like, they already <laughs> said that Jake Paul pays for his... That was like a Karen, you know? Oh! Man. Yeah, like, oh my gosh. You know, he hit me with his car. No. Yeah, like, like it, it was crazy. But what about now, when, when, when Silva fought Whiteman? And he broke his own leg, remember? Oh, yeah, that was crazy. When that he broke his own leg, that was wild. Crazy. And then the first that fight, was he was showboating and he got knocked out. Yeah, that yeah. was wild. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, come on, man. We'll he hit me. <laughs> it's all the bad moments Terrible. still, man. Terrible. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> when good times go bad. He, yeah. he, he did something. one of these, like, you ain't doing nothing. Wow. <laughs> he got, he caught, he caught him with one. Knocked his shit out. That's what he took his belt. He took his belt. Yeah. Whoa, off showboating? That's off yeah. showboating. Yeah, yeah, bro. That's a world star of team clip. Oh, it, it was. was. Wild. Yeah, it was, it was actually. Stupid. It was viral for Damn, a minute. Yeah, that's crazy. It was terrible. He like, got slept, though. <laughs> it just goes to show, hey, always defend yourself at all times. You know? yeah. Oh, that's, that was that controversy with Mayweather that time. Oh, that, no, that was with uh, uh, with uh, Victor always Ortiz. defend yourself at all Victor times. Ortiz on, yeah. Holly, uh, on uh, Halloween. But he had that coming. He was dirty. He was headbutting. Oh, he was cheating. On purpose. <laughs> Bro, cheating. you can't do some cheap shot and then... <laughs> and then cry. And then cry, yeah. Well, he said, oh, I tried to hug him twice. Yeah. yeah, like that. Well, dude, Stop one time is me, okay, bro. dog. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah head get head your butt. ass off me. Bro, <laughs> head buddy when butt. people were like, Mayweather, Mayweather's dirty for that. Like, <laughs> what do you mean? I was one of those people. Because like, I was like, damn, you already was going to whoop him. Why are you sneaking like that? Like, but because he was headbutting him, and then he right, just kept that. on repeating He kept on me. hugging him, like, hey, out of yeah. respect. Like, hey, man, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And he's like, dude, this he is was the third hug already. Get off me, Mac. Yep. Go and to just, sleep. And just Big Mac them with cheese. <laughs> and it was a wrap. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that shit was great. Jack Lantern. Halloween. That Word. was pretty dope. <clears throat> that shit was wild. Zab Judah. I ran into him recently. Oh, Zab Judah. Shout out to New How York. How do you feel yeah. about it? Yeah. I mean, Zab was one of my guys, Zab too. Judah but, you know, he just. I thought that was Sam Cassell at first fighting. You know what I'm saying? That motherfucker. <laughs> ugly as shit. He looked like E.T. With, with boxing gloves on. Remember when E.T. was sick? He looked like that motherfucker. And he was in the, in, in the river oh, and shit. You're I don't like Zab Judah. Zab Judah does have Real? the hardest knockout ever, though. I ain't gonna lie. He got knocked the fuck out. When he did the James Brown, yeah, you know and what I'm saying. Start yeah, choking yeah. out uh, Jay Nady. You wanna leave? Man. Start choking out Jay Nady. Yeah, he, no, he was a temptation yeah. for a second. I <laughs> got a brand new yeah, bag. Yeah, that was David. Uh, David no stuffing. Yeah, that mother got beat David up. David no stuffing. Yeah, <laughs> that's hey, my he, guy. That was out. Yeah, that's my guy. Yeah. Shout out to Zab <laughs> Super Judah. Judah. Yeah, he was dope though. He, he was man. He he was the first uh what unified in in. Like multiple, uh, weight or leg. in the weight yeah. or in the welterweight division, I believe. Well, wait, I think he was he the was last, undisputed? I think he was the last one to be, but it was before the four belt, it was the three belt. Okay, 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 yeah, three belt era. Uh, WBO, but the four WBC, belt, yeah, yeah, right now, like that's why the Crawford Spence fight is so big. It'll be I the can't first wait for that. It will be the first. What do you got on that? Con. What do you got on that? I got Spence. You got Easy. Spence? Yeah, I, I don't know. Oh. I mean, because Crawford, hey, shout out to Omaha, Nebraska. Okay, that guy has, uh, uh-huh. I mean, he got, you know, Let's he switch hits. It. You know, uh-huh. he can fight Southpaw, he can fight uh-huh. Orthodox. So it, it, it's Spence gonna, beats up both. Both of those. But still, he, I don't... He I mean, South Paul's Spence and doesn't switch stances. He don't need to. I think Crawford has a better fucking angle. I mean, a, a better, okay. you know, like a repertoire of of, of, of tools in, in his book. Um, I mean, I, I, I'm going to go with... Gamboa. Rocked, Gamboa? Rocked his chin. He did. He did. He's a, about, uh, he's a 130, yeah. 135 pounder. Yeah, 50 cent. Rocked his well, because he hits hard. chin. Like, right now. But he don't hit hard Nothing. like uh, Spence. They say Spence hits. Spence is harder. I mean, he's taller. He's more stronger. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're he's right. a big welterweight. And right. then on top of that, um, we, we never seen Spence really rock like that. And he's fought That's better true. competition than, yeah, I mean, than Bud has. And then Bud... 
when he fought Benavidez. Benavidez just Benavidez, got shot go. in the leg, yeah, but he got shot in the leg, and he was still rocking, bud. <laughs> bud likes to take punches, leg. though. Bro, he bud was a one-legged punches, man, and he was, yeah, he does, but he can, I, he I can don't move. think, he can move. I don't think he's nothing. gonna be able to do that with Spence. This is a different me. type of punch. Spence breaks his fighters down. But his Spence thing is, is not ready for the angles. Gonna go. He's not ready for the angles. He's not ready for that feet work. He's too quick. A bud is too fucking crafty. Spence is an Olympic. I love them both though. That's the fucking hard part. Spence is an Olympic boxer. I know. Of course he's they're, they're both angles. undefeated. But who's number we one just in the haven't world? Haven't seen him who's come number with angles. One? But that's um. That's because Bud. of Bob Arum. He was under Bob Arum. Still, we all know the he, we all know the ranking for itself. system. His, his record speaks for itself. He's number one in only one belt. His record uh, his record Spence speaks for got itself. Three belts. But still, I'm, I'm gonna go with I don't know. I, I like Crawford. <laughs> I like them both. I mean, they're both undefeated. I think it's gonna be a, so. We're gonna come back to this fight. one after Bud stops running, and you seen what when he did. When does Bud ever? Ooh. When does Bud ever? Who run? is he fighting in his next fight? When you know Bud, that guy's name. When is Bud ever? No, I don't know. Exactly. Exactly. You're right. his, his name is Amnesia. You know why? Because he's getting close. <laughs> it's yeah. like Ambrosia or some shit. He's like getting that. ready. He's getting ready. You know but what he's saying? a nobody. That. Yeah, what do right. you mean? But that's he's Spence hasn't took. Spence oh. w- got in a car crash. Yeah, almost died. Yeah. Flipped, flew out of his car, his Lamborghini, landed, yeah. got his or whole Ferrari, face Lamborghini reconstruction, yeah. came back and has fought nothing but the best of the best. Who did he fight when he came back? No, he didn't. He didn't fight nobody that great. What do you mean? Oh. What did he fight? That was that, that was that great. He fought uh Danny. Danny Swift Garcia. Danny Garcia ain't shit. Come on, oh, bro. Boy. Danny was, was ahead of I mean, that there guy's been done. Oh, not before that. Danny had just only lost to Thurman. Thurman, yeah. And yes. he lost to Porter. Did he lose to Porter? Yeah. It, it was a to close Sean one. Porter? It was a close one. Buddy. That was a debatable. That's why. And he lost, and people s- still debate that one. So, being that he only had two losses on his belt, right. and he was still only lost to other champions. And then he beat out, he, he beat up Morales, too, huh? He, mm-hmm. he retired him. Yeah, Swift. It, yeah. So, yeah, Swift ain't no joke. To come back from a car accident, who, like, again, I wouldn't even want to get hit in Bud, my face. Who's yeah. Bud fighting? Bud has fought Horn. You're going to tell me Horn is better than no, uh, no, not Danny? Never. Not never. So there we go. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Hey, hey, that ain't even the real boxer. The real boxer is fucking Bud's baby mama. You ever see? The, you ever see those videos? <laughs> no, dude. Look up Bud's baby it. mama is crazy, dog. She, that, there's video of her whooping mm. a bitch ass mm. in the motherfucking parking lot. I'm real? like, what the fuck are these bitches fighting That's over? Crazy. Just, watch, look it up. It's crazy. I'm gonna look fuck. it up. We need a fact checker, but let's go on to the next. Uh, let's go. What we got? We got a uh, blue face man. What's, yeah, what's blue up? Face. What's going on with blue face? He just got arrested. Oh, he got arrested man. for uh for beating up his girl again. Uh, <laughs> we wish. Oh shit. This one they're saying is uh, wish, attempted yo. murder. Attempted murder. So it's oh, more yo. serious. Hey, yeah. honestly, I, uh, yeah, yeah, it's true. I don't think we he do tried to murder that. his girl. Nah, that pussy's too good. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. He ain't murdering that shit. If it's that good, Not then maybe. he might. He might if it's that good, he's, you feel me? Hell nah. It, the the fact that he stayed he this might. whole time, she's crazy. That shit's fired. I ain't gonna lie, like he I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it again. This bitch got a tattoo on I'm, I'm of him on her and like, a tooth. With his, with like his she face. ruining his career. Oh yeah, me? yeah. Like it, like man, they're just turning yeah, into a, a she TV was on that, show. She was situation. on that show. She was on that show. Uh, Batty South. Right. Yo, she beat up a bitch every single episode. <laughs> She's with the business. Yo. Hey, I watched it just because I knew she was on it, and I was like, okay, fight scene. Skip to it. Fired she it up. up. She beat up a bitch in the sink. Uh. She washed that bitch out real good. She, she, Here, bitch, she get said, yourself she said, together. She said, all right. She said, that was a cheap shot. She said, all right, I'll stand Run up with again. you. Yep. Stood up with her, did a little Mayweather shoulder roll, bro. Uh. I swear, I never, I never seen this bitch do that. Damn, bitch, and bro. I just said pretty girls Boom. can't fight. Yeah, and then right. she knocked the wig off the bitch. Oh, and I said, the and, then, and then she got mad, and then they broke it up. You think she's about, pretty? Like, yo, I think she's pretty. I think she's very pretty. Hey, I think she's pretty without the gap. I love the gap. You know, she can hold a mm. cigarette in that motherfucker, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm <laughs> yeah, like, that's hey, that gap might be good for is a few reasons, Is it a gap, though. or is she missing a tooth? <laughs> hold a black and mild in that motherfucker. She's missing a tooth, okay? She's missing, she's missing a, tooth. a tooth, right? So, so like, that missing tooth, Now oh, it has you feel faces. me? It might, it might be good for a couple, couple reasons, you feel me? But. Like what? <laughs> 
I'm this holding crazy. a cigarette. Yeah, he's me? right. She, nah, she, you she wilding, replaced, B. She replaced it, you feel me? So what you fitting in there, bro? She replaced it with a face bump, bro. No, she replaced it with a, with, <laughs> with a tooth of his of his face on it. Yeah, yeah like that She crazy. put a tooth wow. of his a, face. A blue face. Yeah, she already had him on her on It's her called a Bluetooth. Like what? A Bluetooth? Like five, six yeah. of his face. It's wireless. Yeah, she, she obsessed. It really? says blue face on her face. No, no. No, she has five or six has, tattoos of his face. It's portrait everywhere over her body. Like, that motherfucker. So he's holding it down. Yo, that. But she would. But she would. There is, he's piping this is her. My but there shit. is a. My yeah, God, he's piping. But there her, is bro. a video going around saying that she's only with him to benefit her and shit. Like no you shit. Feel me? But like he acted I mean, all shocked. I'm like, bro. Like she been but that many that. tattoos. You feel me? She been said that. Like. I don't know, bro. She might do it for her auntie. She a a lot of a lot of girls do. Oh, it, she so. signed a blue face, so she raps. She yeah, was she's blue she was artist. okay. She was his artist Ooh. before they even start fucking with each other. It's bad for oh, business. This is news to me. Bad okay, so business. like he started fucking with her after she became the artist. You feel me? Like uh. if she was the artist for a minute, then he started fucking with her. You feel me? And then now you have this whole shit show you feel me it's That's crazy, crazy. It's, it's wild she could have like, had a great career she just fucked up everything i'm not gonna lie a real loke don't move like this your bitch be hitting on you you That's get true. rid of that bitch no you choke slam that bitch you, you, you don't right. you don't let no woman put hands on you you gotta be a or man vice versa day, you feel me or vice versa like, yeah. yeah 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 like nobody should and, be putting like, hands on nobody like as, a, as a man you like you shouldn't even put hands on a woman you're gonna get that far you should just leave the bitch and then go on and move on facts. you feel me like it shouldn't even get that far but, my man yeah. on this grown man shit. But you growing I'm up, my hey. boy. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> your green yeah, eyes yeah, are turning yeah, yeah. brown. Yeah, man. So like, I'm, I like it. I'm praying, <laughs> I'm praying for uh, blue face. You feel me? But um, it's unfortunate that you got arrested. So you ain't never Mayweather the bitch when she cheated on you. Hell no. Nah, 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 nah. Hell no. Nah. If uh, if would, anything, he went in a Mayweather. And moved he would have Manny Pacquiao. He would have Manny Pacquiao. I'll tell you. I'll tell you one scenario. You feel me? Like in high school. You feel me? Damn. One bitch cheated on me with my cousin. Damn. Oh, I what's your cousin? And, and, was he taller? And then, yeah, he was. Actually. Fucking Spud Web. He, he was taller, bitch. you feel me? You guys should have got her you back. You I should have tag did, teamed did, her did. out and filmed him. I put did, it though. on the internet. I did, though. Yeah. I did. I went to her house, you feel me? Her sister was there when she wasn't there. I ended up smashing, you feel me? It got mm. around the whole school, you feel me? She felt embarrassed, you feel me? So I was. That's right. Very Championship relieved, rounds. You feel me? I, I was yeah. like, cool. You feel me? And then my cousin was like, I did that for you. I'm like, I don't give a fuck no more. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, already, I, already I was trying to show you what kind of bitch you had, player. The one who smashed the bitch. I told you she wasn't shit, so I smashed to make yeah, sure that it, she wasn't By the way, can we come over later? Did, did like, he tell you she wasn't shit before that? Yeah, he did. He did. Oh, he was okay, like, so maybe he was then. He was in love. He was telling me, yeah, he was like, man, she ain't shit, whatever. This is like my first, like, oh, he was looking out. He did right. He did right. He was looking out. He was like, nah, nah, she ho, you know. It's a dirty game, bro. He did him dirty. Oh, he wasn't yeah. gonna listen. He was in yeah. love. Yeah, she was he was still. gonna let her play him all high school behind his back. Yeah, because work. like like back Without then, you feel me? Steep. Back then, that was my first serious relationship, so I wasn't really up on game like right. how, how bitches she was going, whipping you. Feel you. Me? So she, yeah, exactly. She, she was, was right. She was right. So your cousin came so, around to make you. Wait open a minute. Your eyes. Wait a minute. She had fire coaching. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what it was about. Fire coochie when you in high school. Well, I guess that. It's better than jacking off. Anything is better than being alone. That part. It's better than jacking off in the shower. Like, man, I'm about to get one. I was in high school. You were 30, you were pussy and still pussy. But like I said, this was my first serious relationship. You know how to judge better. So it was like... It probably wasn't that good, but I thought it was that like, good in my head because it was my first year of relationship. See, yeah. that part. Your cousin so saw you so getting it. I've seen that before. Yeah, so, so he was telling me, you feel me? Let like, me test just, it out. Let me test it, it out first. And I was like, nah, bro, she ain't, she ain't fucking around with nobody. You feel me? He said he's seen her at parties he, and shit. He not fucking lying. around with a lot of bitches. I went through the same lot of thing before. Boyfriends, you feel me? And I'm like, oh, she trying to be a home record with other people too? Like, that's crazy. Damn. He ended up just smashing her in the team room, the football room. I told you that bitch was just shit. Oh. Uh, yeah, <laughs> she man. fucked him on campus too. Your girl was crazy. What's crazy, crazy is crazy. I walked in. What oh, you walked in? Oh, oh, so I walked, what was you walking in? It was in a there? family reunion no, walked, and it, that motherfucker. It was the team room. Oh. It was the football Hold on. room. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's getting spooky. Yeah, What's yeah. going on so, here? So, so say so say like, <laughs> say like, you feel me? I had to go in there to dress out for for sixth period to go to the weight room. You oh, feel this me? Is right. a real one. They in there. You feel me? Like after fifth period, bell rings or whatever. Like that, I go there. Damn. You feel me? It's like five minutes after the bell rings. They not even budging to go to class. The lights are off and shit. I hear lockers banging. Oh, he was banging me? lockers. You heard me? Wow. So what I the turn hell on the is light. going on? I see her. She tried. She tried to explain he knew the password. The shit. 
He had the combination. Said, and I said, she's trying to say that, like, he convinced her and shit. She tried to pull some whole shit. And I'm like, nobody could convince. Like, yeah, you, you can't, can't convince be convinced, a man to beat. Bitch. You feel me? Says like, who? Like, you let the man beat. You feel me? Like, yeah, women he fucked choose up. who have said. He yeah, convinced. You the key. Said so, he convinced. That's how you know who your real cousins are, so motherfucker. Like, All right. So he ended, up, he ended up telling me, like, like bro, dirty, I told you. It's a dirty he told game. Me, he's like this, bro. Bro, bro. I, told I you. only got girl cousins. Cousin play cousins. Yeah. I was your cousin before, okay, and I told, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I was trying to tell a dude <laughs> that this bitch out of your league, bro. She fucking all type of niggas and all that. That's bitch fucked niggas up. And, that. Yeah. and the homie was like, Nah, bro, no, she not. I pick her yeah. up. I drop her off. Blah blah blah. blah. Yeah. She was, hey, she was. Fucking, she was getting she, gutted. And she then she fucking, asked me, "Can she use the restroom?" And my girl took her to use the restroom, and she never came back outside. Yeah, he said, "Dirty that. game." What he happened? Did she went out the window? No, the homie was just like, "Bro, could you go get her out? She's taking too long and all that." And I'm like, "Bro, she." They texting me saying she overdosed she in the over bathroom. You. Oh she yeah, did some weird shit. You gotta get on. She don't want to go home with you. And he like, oh, Damn. bro, don't fuck my bitch. And I'm like, I'm not even upstairs. Why can't a female just say that? Yeah. You know what? Hey. It's over, no, motherfucker. No, no. Nah, nah when a dude, dude. You ain't got shit. No, he no, said no. another hold dude. On, the on, dude is on. telling him, don't fuck hold my hold bitch. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, That's let me crazy. Let me explain it. You gotta be a weenie. Him and the bitch had got into a slight argument. At my house, outside. Mm. So they was like talking about it or whatever, but she said, can I use the restroom? So my girl was like, all right, I'll oh, take you. So yeah. my girl took her to the restroom in the middle of the argument, basically. Right. So she had a little grip to be able yeah. to tell, yeah. get on, bro. Yeah. I'm mad at you right now. So, so he, she put you in the middle of it and you was like, hey, go out there and tell this motherfucker point. something. No, I never went in. Me and oh, you never told him that? Together. Oh, okay. So we was just smoking, chilling, and we noticed like, damn, it's been like an hour. She <laughs> so I hit him up like, hey, where's she at? They're like, my, my, terrified. Girl said, my girl was like, she not leaving with bro. She mad at He just pressed her and all that. Mm. So I didn't see the play yet. I'm stupid. I'm sitting there smoking like, damn, that bitch mad at you, bro. Just get on. I'm not going to stay out here with you all day. Ooh. And he like. Where my bitch at? He like, bro. Hey, get that outside. bitch over here. Tell her we said, gotta bro, go. How can I make <laughs> you, go. How can I make a bitch come outside? That's not my bitch. Yeah. Is she mad at you? That's weird. It's like I'm forcing her to be with a weirdo. Like, yeah, you should. Like, I don't want to be involved yeah. in that. So he was like, all right, saw that. Like, hit me when she leave, or if you see Damn. me with a nigga. I'd be like, she's in the shower, motherfucker. So you when I go, go in the house, what happened? It was crazy over there. What happened? That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, okay. I yeah, see where this is going. Okay, okay. He ain't I'm shit, like, but what's oh, up with your no, motherfucking bitch? I just went in yeah. That's on my soul. I just went in Hey, I ain't gonna lie, though. I started though. watching TV. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all didn't I'm threesome. Don't lie to me. It was crazy I'm gonna take, I'm I'm gonna take full accountability for that. That shit that happened, though, because... Like, sometimes you gotta know like, the bitch is trash. Like, I didn't even threesome. know. I didn't know the bitch was trash. You feel me? I could have I could have just like left the bitch alone like he said you feel me and that would if he would have hit it wouldn't even hurt you feel me it hurt I ain't gonna hold you of course that's but your cousin you that was your I ain't even gonna I ain't even gonna lie I'd have fired on him yeah. but then you now know this motherfucker like, was Joey Greco well, I he get walked it. right well, in well, on he would have had to apologize when he got older well, and after, realize what well, happened after for this real. he pulled me aside he saved your life bro he pulled me aside like you could have got her pregnant yeah he pulled me aside like a year ago yeah see he saved your life he was telling me like. Hey, you still mad about that? You feel me? You can fire on me right now. I want to hold it against you. And he just said that because like, you were short, like, dog, and, like, and the punches like, wouldn't have hurt. Like, <laughs> That's fucked no, up. No, no, no. Fire gonna, on me right now, dog. You know, hey, all right, I deserve that. I, I deserve go, that. I ain't gonna hold you. He he had a bird chest. I would have made him shit himself. If I hit him. You Ooh, feel me? Like, oh. hey, like, I'm not gonna stab his ass. You, bro. I would have. It, it as, as a big big homie to people. He did right by you, bro. Yeah, he did. He did. Yes, he did. No, no, he did. Because the girl. Your cousin fucked. Yo, it's bro, he was he, he, he was in high school. Hey. It's for me being the, in high school. He didn't even ask me. As he did. For, he did for, ask. No, he told he told he when told he said me, that like, she was trash and she was getting me. around. That's basically bro. He the said, conversation right he said, that's an insinuation, right? But he said but she was going to she she the door. Exactly. He said she was going to all these rich niggas' houses and shit, like mansion parties <laughs> and, and he shit. We should have hit her up. Where's the money at, bitch? He wasn't looking at that. I'm looking at that like. This bitch in high school still. She ain't doing that you shit. Crazy. And, and he's like, he's like, oh, you should have got that paper, man. This is like 2012. Oh, like, right, you feel right. me? It's, it's like, it's not, it's, it's not even like when, it's not when, when Instagram, Instagram was popping. Right, you feel right, me? Right. It was still so, Facebook. Yeah, so it was like they still had a demographic where they could, they only could reach. You feel me? A certain demographic. <laughs> so, right. so, <laughs> so I'm like, all right, cool. But he was telling me this shit. I was like, nah, that that ain't real. You feel me? When I told him that, you feel me, and then I caught them, he pulled me aside, and he was just like, nah, I did this for you, you feel me, like, I ain't gonna hold oh you, bro, my God. we start, we start, like, we're about to fade, and bro, we're, I'm at, not gonna lie. we're at school, she wasn't so like, we're at school, but, so like, would you have respected the cousin to let him die with the bitch, why is it more worse that he fucked her? 
Nah, because, because that's would, your cousin. But that's he why did, fucker, <laughs> he would have lost more. It doesn't still matter be for the bitch. How doesn't it matter if it's a deeper he, loss? It's a difference between him telling them that like, hey, hey, your bitch ain't shit. He did that. He did that. Hey, but I did that. I'm gonna hold you. He didn't listen. Like, okay, I told so, you that bitch so was shit, dog. Like what the fuck? I'm gonna hold you. He he ain't shit for doing that, Stu. Because because it's it's like but I bet you they still don't talk to this day. Just say your big brother didn't like the homie you was hanging with because he was a bad influence and he fucked your homie up. That's the same difference. Yeah, they're true. trying to save you and you're not it's, listening. He doesn't love his homie, so though. So basically, <laughs> huh? he could. Why would you he say that? He could. Why would you say that? He could love his homie. And he that's why he like, won't stop fucking with him. Why you fuck a homie up, dog? You know I love him. Yeah. That's my boy, bro. Why you fucking up? Shit it on himself. Hey, hey, but nah, like um, him doing that made me get, made me yeah, right. like, yeah, I mean, learn how, it was it a made lesson. me learn how to attract attract bitches to stay with me. No, you I mean, not to get that. them to stay. You feel me? Because, she because but it lets you know his character too. Because now I, I guarantee you, now if you get another girl that's very very righteous to you. Hey, yeah. you ain't coming over to my house to play no yeah. PS5. You hey, got me I fucked did. up, dog. Hey, you got your own PS5. Play I know house, you. Hey. You ain't gonna bring that motherfucker back over. Ever since then, Don't I, never to brought, I, ever, I never brought a girl around him ever since then. He got then. that thing, thing. But, but, <laughs> but Fuck around with him. The reason why is because he you. <laughs> I, I, I'm looking at it you like... Mario and he Luigi. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he Mario. GameCube. That motherfucker bouncer. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, hey, hey, it's game over right here. Bitch, it's my shit. See, he Mario, but when like bitches find out that I'm the one that can really protect them at the end of the day they mm. come back to me you feel me mm. I'm, oh, short, so I'm short you, but I call the shots so you Wario uh, I, I hear you I tell, I tell, <laughs> hey, Wario I tell them, I tell it's them a where difference. they can go, but they can go you feel me yeah. but like at the end of the day like I'm not even on that like red pill type shit. You feel me? I'm not on that shit. I just, just respect. We the all know you want a blue pill. Yeah. We all know. Let you go down, down the wrong path. I'm a <laughs> the blue, I'm the a blue pill. I'm a blue pill. Wario, it's blue, blue shell. We're gang banging. I don't want the red pill, bitch. I want the blue pill. It's crazy. Yeah, bro. Like, but um, <clears throat> but yeah, like you said, yeah, my cousin did that to like yeah, help crazy. me out to really but realize did he? it. Because if he didn't fuck that bitch, you would have been a stupid. <laughs> for 10 years. I know a lot of niggas. But like he still would have been getting along with his cousin though to this day. He's and his cousin along wor- with his cousin. and his cousin's worth hey, way more uh, than that bitch was. I guarantee you. At the end you that. of the day, he was gonna be getting ran. He, he was him. gonna be getting ran by bad bitches who fuck niggas behind his back until he was twenty six. I mean, look at him. What did you cheat? Would you cheat on you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> not at not, God not at, damn. Not at the status I am now, you feel me? Like I'm say, with you. say you feel me in high school years. You're the hottest battle rapper right now, boy. Going, you got bitches. But now you feel me like you ain't worried you know, about I'm, that. I'm, I'm signed with Crooked, you feel me? And yeah, then right. I I'm with, I'm with clean in R three and battle rap. So that's like right, my baby. status is up there. Man, yeah. like, what is a high value man like, to I go, that bitch I who fucked you. his cousin back in the day? Now you stripping on OnlyFans and still probably fucking his cousin right now. And he works for Chip and Dale on OnlyFans. I, I didn't yeah. hear she had an OnlyFans, hey. but I'm not, even, I'm not even gonna ask about Shout it. Shout out to her OnlyFans. Have seen or whacked after she that don't day? got man one on her OnlyFans. No, you've never seen or <laughs> whacked her after that day. No, well you I did. Lost. I did. You I, lost in real life. Okay, I did. I did, I did see her. I did. I did see, see her. And then counselor. My boy, but, but I'm more mad at the I fact did. that this bitch was fucking people that had money and he didn't get no money off that bitch. That's why I told you the cousin. But it's a difference. But see, the thing is, that's levels. There's levels. She that, was, that's a, she see, was more if he wasn't, if okay, he wasn't okay, so, willing to so admit like, the fact that she was it, fucking other people, she definitely ain't. He definitely ain't ready to run the game. Yeah, you, right. you, 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 you know gotta see I'm this saying? though. I was like fourteen to fifteen. You feel me? Yeah. It wasn't that's like what I'm it saying. wasn't you just like ready. It was, it was yes, yes, yes. That's why I was trying to tell you. I didn't believe it because I was confused. I was like, I'm only fourteen, fifteen. I'm supposed to compete with this grown ass twenty five year old. You feel me? So like. Did she take your virginity? Yeah. There oh, it goes. She, she, so she that's, molded that's him. Where, she did. Yeah. That's where. But then, and if she was then, fucking all these older people, yeah. you know, she knew what she was doing. doing. She, she was doing lobbing that. the yeah. knob. Oh, she was, oh. mind you, yeah. so she was, she was doing right. her shit. She was doing her oh. right. So mind no, you. I get it. So mind you, after that day. That's fucked up, but I get it. After that day, you feel me? It took me like five years to stop dogging bitches. You feel me? Yeah. Because, like, I was like, oh, man, fuck that. Nah, but. I was in like, love with her. But now. Was she now, white, Mexican, black? What was she? Uh, she, was, she was Latina. You she know was Latina? She was half Latina, half Asian. Yeah. yeah it would have been better yeah. if she was oh, Asian. Yeah. She was bad, yeah. yeah. She, was, she was baddie. So she was I'm dripping and tight, tight. Hey, hey, I'm not going to lie. She probably is a stripper right she now. Like, in love and with your only sister fans. grind in that pole. Hey. Yeah, but not like. Yeah, my cousin put me up on her game because the way he didn't do that, like he hey. would have said, I would have been like, you would have been 20, up to twenty six. I, I swear to God, yeah, yeah, I would have been tricking. Like, like, 
Feel tricking. Me? Paying you for pussy. Been boy, hey, that's 15. You're 15. Yeah. That's, that's a life lesson. Yeah, exactly. now, now you saved your life. Now I'm 29. You saved you your me? life. Now I'm 29, and I'm like, yeah, I already know. Y'all act like y'all ain't never got cheated on. Is he the only one that got cheated on? I mean, nah, have you got cheated on in your adult life? On. In your adult life. Everybody's been cheated on. Depends we just don't you know about it, it now. We just uh, don't know about it. We in a new we, we up in to the new, speaker. We in a new era. Somebody hooked up to the speaker. Wildin'. We find out somebody's sitting on the stairs. What's going on? Using That's the Wi-Fi. Crazy. Nobody. <laughs> 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 Using Wi-Fi. Using Wi-Fi. Using Wi-Fi. Bitch, wait for me. That's crazy. I'm his cousin. I'm about to go in there right now. But nah, like, no, y'all been cheating on before? Hell yeah, I've been cheating on before. I get cheated on every day. Have you walked ever. into Let's it? Talk about it. Have I ever caught it? Yeah, cheating? have you ever walked in on it? I mean, that's mm. some fucked up the shit. The worst bitch. cheating story That traumatized me. You're all contagious. Well, I don't know. I, I never looked yeah, at girls. I never really had crazy, girlfriends. I used to just bro. be fucking bitches. But let me tell y'all a story. I'm going to tell you a story a after. Go ahead. Where I caught a bitch that I was fucking. She was my girlfriend, but I was fucking. And I, I didn't know she had another nigga anyway, but. I don't know if that's You knew or you didn't? I didn't no, know. You, were get, you were the one being the... You, you were I was the, the side nigga. Shit. Yeah, oh, you were cheating. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Side so nigga nation. You were the cheaty. But I, yep. no, I, thought was, I, I thought she was just a random bitch that was probably had niggas and all that, but yeah, yeah, I didn't yeah. know about them. So I'm over there chilling. I whack in the shower and outside the shower and shit. And then she go to sleep. So I walk to uh, Pronto's Pizza right there in the 6 O's on uh, Crenshaw, you know. Shout out yeah, Crenshaw, yeah, yeah. yeah. It was Tumbies, I think. It was Tumbies. Okay, Tumbies. Mm. Yeah. Right there on Crenshaw and High Park. So I walked oh, right there. Shit. I had chains on and all that, I swear to God. Yeah, uh, buy the pizza. <laughs> and then I sagged back to her house on foot. They, 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 they treated me player over there. Shout out to the mm-hmm. 6 O's. They did. Oh, dang. They did, right. As they should. Yeah. And uh, so when I get back, she's still asleep. I roll me up a blunt. I'm eating the pizza. I need a lighter. This is how I caught her because I needed a lighter. So I'm looking around the house. You no. only smashed one time, though. I'm talking about your no, girl. No, what I'm trying to say is I never really had girls. So oh, I got stories. okay, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I got stories yeah. when I got girls. Oh, my bad, bad, my bad. Okay, I got you. Cheating on me, but I can't call that cheating because yeah. it wasn't yeah, obligated see, to me. Yeah, you're not talking about But you caught the bitch. But, He's but, doing on, some janky right, shit. Right, yeah, so okay, I got you. So, so I'm looking for a lighter, so I go in her purse, and I look for the lighter, and I see some uh, some letters from a jail, and she was writing a nigga in jail. I'm like, damn, this is a Little pistol starter. So I grab my water bottle. And I poured it on a bitch while she was asleep, like squirt. And she woke up like, oh shit, why you just wake me up? And I'm like, bitch, I just found your jail letters. I'm out of here. And I left. Yeah, this was smashed twice and he, he went through her purse. <laughs> I was looking for a lighter. I was looking for a lighter. He's uh, looking for a lighter. Look at him. I'm looking everywhere in place on, on, on my soul. Why'd you, why'd you put the water out? She just went out. This bitch is asleep already, anyways. I'm because out. Because I just thought that that you was funny. It was a I'm disrespectful. A I'm a little comedian. So I'm like, what's the worst non threatening thing I can do. I can't do nothing bad because I'm a real nigga. You feel me? So I'm like, I can't hit the bitch. I can't. Ladies and gentlemen, that's, that's like what that. y'all heard when he when he opened up the purse. So, nigga, that I just poured, Who the fuck is that? Hey, I, no, just poured the water, I just poured the water on her. That's hilarious. Oh, I would have did that shit too. Fuck that bitch. <laughs> you trying to play games with me too, bitch? No, I'm going to write your man in jail, bitch. Watch. Hey, I got hey. his address, bitch. Hey, hey, I said that. Yeah, yeah. I said that. I'm going to hit up little I said, now I'm keeping the letters and I'm going to write them while you're in jail. She What's was going like, on, my oh, boy? shit. You good? Uh, the door was she open too long. For the letters. They didn't, they didn't shut I, the door. I mean, I'm going to tell you one. Hey, go ahead. So, other question. Are you going to tell a story? Oh, yeah, I mean, I want to tell a story about when I when I had caught the bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. This bitch thought she could never get caught cheating. And she has three of my kids, mind you. So, I'm working out of state. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm a union carpenter. You know, I build bridges for the freeways and shit. So, I'm out there in Laughlin. So, you know, we, by the time I get back, you know, I only come home Friday, you know, Friday after work, Saturday, Sunday, and then I'm, I'm back up in Laughlin in Nevada. So, fucking, you know, and when, when I come home, we're always fighting. So, I say, you know what, bitch? Okay, something's going on here. You know what I'm saying? So, what I do, I go and buy a GoPro. I put it under some fucking, you know, I put mm. it under some, some, some shit that she doesn't touch. Because every time I come home, the house is dirty. I come home, I, well, I, I put it under, the, uh, under some clothes, some dirty clothes. Because I know this bitch ain't doing no laundry. <laughs> sure enough. I come back home, I beat her to the punch. Boom, I'm at home on Friday. You know, I'm winding the tape. You know, I mean, fast forward in it, I have it like running on three, three fast forward. You know, I mean, my chicharrones with butt ice. And I see movement in there. So I say, oh shit, let me take this, let me stop this motherfucker and let me play it. This motherfucker, I, I see movement in there. So, you know, mind you, I'm like, all right, okay, we all know. This bitch had the nerve, my baby mama had the nerve to fuck somebody in my, on our bed. 
And oh. I was like, what the fuck? And the motherfucker couldn't even fuck. He was fucking like like a pit bull in the alley. Oh. <laughs> Like and he didn't even last that long. So I was thinking, you know, hey, all right, I'm gonna tell this bitch when she gets home. You know what I'm saying? And I'm drinking my butt ice. You know, I'm already buzzed by then. I'm like, nah, I ain't gonna say nothing because I hid the camera. She didn't know. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I hid another two butt ices, 32 ounces. I said, you know what? I'm a little buzzed now. Fuck this bitch. Hey, come here. Come in the room right quick. Oh, you think you're too goody two shoe, huh, bitch? What if, what the fuck is this? You put it on TV? I put it. Yeah, I was watching it on hey. TV. You know, I hooked it up to the HDMI. What the uh-huh. fuck is this? And she's like, and you're showing me this because why? Wow. I was like, look at, you fuck somebody on our bed? I'm like, look at the motherfucker can't even fuck anyways. He didn't even put his leg up when he was in there doggy you're style, stupid. bitch. Oh, this is oh. bullshit. Real talk. I'm like, you know what? We good. I'm like, I'm out of here. I'm some real shit. I'm coming next week with a U-Haul. I'm moving all my shit. I haven't seen my kids in six years. She took my kids from me, all three of them. Damn. Because of that. Damn. Because of that. Crazy. Yeah, real talk. You caught her fucking up. Real talk, yep. I caught her, I caught her fucking up. On some real t- but then again, I was fucking up too, but we could have fixed it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Let's cheat together, bitch. Like, why are we doing it behind our backs? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I critique the shit. I critique the fuck. Like, but then again, <laughs> what if the shoe was on the other foot? Hey, what if yeah. the shoe. What, what if she was. What if, what if, if he was piping, piping it down? Yeah, yeah. What if it was a big piping motherfucker? Like, bam, bam. You I would have done that. Like, shit. I would have threw the GoPro slain. away. You know what? Fuck this shit. She hey. earned that. Yeah, hey, you know what? He got that. Yeah. <laughs> He's yeah, slanging he it. He wins. He wins. You know? He, That's funny. He could have the house, too. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Uh, you, got, uh, you got Pat stay in there. Rest in peace. You know what I'm saying? Like, that motherfucker yeah. tall. <laughs> he was fucking it up. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't even have shoulder. Wouldn't even have shit. You would have just took that one. I would have took it as an L, real talk. I would have been like, hey, I know what to get You would have tried to go get something better. I would have washed the clothes. You know what I'm saying? I would have did the laundry. I would have been like, man, I feel like a bitch. Let me wash the sheets. Yeah, damn, that's fucked up. <laughs> I, no, no, I, I even I told her, you know what? I even had the decency to fuck uh, 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 somebody on our couch, not on our bed, bitch. I'm like, that's fucked up. You're you want funny. some janky ass shit, bitch. You're For a bitch funny. to fuck on your bed, that's some disrespectful shit. No, that's, that's shit, wildin'. Dog. Yeah, that bitch crazy. That's wildin'. But that's my story. Go ahead, my boy. It's, it's on you. Hey, it's on you, actually. Yeah. We got cheated on? Not, not that I know, bro. To be honest, um, like the girl, so I, the girl I was with for my long term, mm-hmm. I was with her for eleven years. We we're, we we're, mm. yeah, we were from high school, but I de-virginized her. Like, oh, so she that was, was your move on me, yeah, for like till we broke up. Feel me? Mm. So like, I never really had to go through all the shit that right. everyone else really had to go through in in situations. I mean, I mean that that rates your dick. Though. And then I didn't, I didn't fuck with nothing for like years. You hear me like though? You hear me though? That dick. rates your dick though. Like if you turn her out and take her virginity and you fuck the dog shit out of her and she starts being a hoe, that's how good your dick was. Nah, but she didn't you know actually. Saying? Well, because your dick was she, trash. Like, like rest in, <laughs> nah, 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 nah. I'll fuck you with you. Go right, ahead, go ahead. Like rest in peace. Like that's what she passed. Oh away. yeah. Oh, I'm sorry yeah, about yeah, that. My yeah, bad. I'm over yeah. making a joke out of it. My bad. Yeah. Um, Damn, that's fucked up. Hey, no, no, but yeah, I, I, she I was it. just a she. Like we used to call her nun when she when she was in school. She was like the good girl. Oh, so you think Oh yeah. He found one of the good ones. Yeah. Well, because I was I was the school hoe. You know what I mean? Like, you was, you was a everything. whole lot of fun. Man, like, you're so lucky, one bro. Time, you ain't you know. five feet tall. He wasn't pulling no hoes in high school. You nah. sound retarded. This motherfucker, he, he was a break dancer, but he could only do head spins. <laughs> really know. Like, I ain't got a lot. He, he could do a half a windmill when he was a break He was a break dancer. Crazy as hell. Nah, I didn't wife nothing up to we were getting not out of school because I wasn't going to college. I was, I was dropping out. Feel me? So I was like, bro. I'm taking the one that was yeah. the one. I yeah. like. I went through, ran through the shit, and was like, "Okay, bomb. Cool. Take the one. I'm gone. I this, dropped this, out of school." This motherfucker hooked her with a guitar gonna... case full of comic books. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> Let me find out you was that Say geek. Comic books. Was you a geek? Yeah. Huh? Nah. Was you a geek? No. Okay. Nah. I had. I was the uh, party thrower. Like I had turntables. Oh, you had turntables. You was all. I was selling That's weed why? and what shit. What the fuck about Yeah, I was selling weed, turntables. You know what I mean? So I was throwing the parties. Bitch is gonna fuck him just just because he the man. Yeah, because he's the DJ. That's why you. Like that's why I throw shows still to this day. You know what I mean? I've been doing it since I was thirteen. And he had the weed, so you can't even. Yeah. All you motherfuckers, get out on the ground! Bro, what's going on? We got a bunch of phones. I'm gonna have to go check this shit. Let's go. Come on. Um, hey, we, y'all, we're gonna, we gonna take a fucking five minute break, y'all. Oh. Here you go. The fifth element device. Dude, that shit right there. Hey, don't, don't drink. This me. shit is crazy. That shit'll fucking blow up in your hands. I, I'm telling you, it felt like it was a detonator. It's a, a little baby M80. Oh, yeah. oh. Shit is crazy. Y'all know me. Um, I sold a lot of shoes, hats, and clothes and shit. Sports gear, vintage clothes, and all that. 
So I ran across a lot of celebrities in my business. But, um, like but I you're rocking about the young Duff. I'm rocking some Supreme Fives. Ooh, those are, hey, those, those are nice. Those These are nice. These came out in like 2015. I was uh, fresh in the shoe game. Actually, uh, um, I don't think I got these for retail back then. Uh, I probably like fin- finagled it with one of my customers mm-hmm. who won a raffle or something, but or won a chance to go in Supreme. But um, I had all the colors. I had the black, red. I had the black and red ones, the white and red ones, and these. I'm stuck Sold with these them. now. Sold the other ones for good money at sneaker cons and shit. Mm-hmm. But um, I done met a lot of famous people, and like like Carlos Miller, I seen him at Fox before, and he was in like finish line looking at all the trash Jordans. So, I, <laughs> so I, what, he, he wasn't looking or being aware of his surroundings. No I, retros? He was just looking at random yeah, Jordans? some random trash on the wall. So I walked up on the side of him. He never looked at me. He was looking at the wall still, and I was just talking to him like Secret Service. I'm like, bro, <laughs> I'm like, bro why, you, why, why you looking at this trash shit? Like, I sell uh, fire-ass shoes and shit. Like, you need to hit, hit me up. Right. So he um, he listened to me and shit, got my Instagram down. He was already blue-checked up and all that. Um, he hit me up and told me he wanted to buy some shoes. I sent him what I had in size 11, Carlos yeah. Miller size 11. I sent him what I had, size 11, and he, he wanted some. And then he's like, yeah, where were we going to meet up at? And I'm like, what? And he never responded. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I ain't going to Grapes. I ain't going to Grapes. Like, I ain't going. That nigga never responded. I don't even drink wine. I, I ain't going to Grapes. But that's when I, I was in the streets. <laughs> that's when I was in the streets still selling shoes out of the backyard. You feel me? Yeah. So eventually I moved up into stores and started really cracking the famous people. Like, I think I told you before, um, Young Dolph came in my store before he died. Yeah, oh, so yeah. Dead homies. Rest he, in peace, bro. Rest he bought shoes for him and his whole entourage, even his daddy. I told you. Yeah. His daddy went to Space Jams for five fifty. He, mm. like, he was like, "Damn, daddy, you went to Space Jams?" His daddy was like, "Hell yeah." <laughs> That's some so good taste. Young Dolph bought like three pair for himself. He bought Key Glock a pair. He bought his dad a pair and all that. Fire. So I mean, I, I've been I've been pulling them in, bro. I've been doing my shit for a few years. I'm not just. A weird old selling shoes out here. I'm really the man. I used to really camp out outside the stores with friends and family. I would pay young niggas and all that. I was outside the stores. Getting with, all of With it. 25 heads, buying all shoe warehouses. They'd get 21 pairs. I'd buy them all. Yeah, of course. I, I had little Dirt kids. Bag. I had little kids DMing me. Everyone else crying outside. I had little kids DMing me. I come out and get one, Mom. I had little kids DMing me saying, camps. hey, bro. Every time I camp out at that store right there, you buy all the shoes. I'll never get to get a pair. Does it come with the soundtrack? Like, welcome to the Space Jam. So I told Here's your like, chance. Like, do your dance. I tell the little kid. Space. Oh. <laughs> I tell the little kid, like, hey, bro, what size you wear? He, he was like, I'm an eight, eight and a half. I'm like, all right, bro, check it out. I believe I could fly. If you come, oh. out, <laughs> if you come out and give Try me some pairs again. on the days that, that you don't want the shoe, I'll always make sure you get the shoe. That's what's up. So I start plugging that nigga in, and he sells shoes now. He booming. Just off not getting a shoe and hitting me up like a real nigga. Because the other little niggas, they used to cry, like he said, try to tell on us and shit, get us in trouble, but it didn't work because we was doing everything legit. Hey, Team Monsters. Yeah. Nigga, I used to buy out every store, team nigga. God K. Go to Millennium Dang. Shoes in Inglewood of Eucalyptus. I used to buy that store out every yeah, Saturday. So just don't, don't go over there to Eucalyptus yeah. to get your shoes because he's homies. a dickhead. I used to go to yeah. all the warehouses, all the yeah. shoe houses. You don't got no buy one, get one free, y'all. Don't Fig think y'all gonna come over here and get some free shit. I was killing all no. the warehouses and all that. I don't, I don't camp out no more. Y'all good. Y'all good. I don't camp out no more. You got advanced. the plug. Yeah, I don't yeah, count yeah. out no more. But when you start off, you need to do that footwork, get your network in, mm. spend some money in these stores. They're going to look out. That's I have, I have yeah. backdoor activities and all that. I used to be able to give a store 10 bands for all the shoes I want. Damn. I swear to God, if some shoes was coming out Saturday. Like AD with hats. Yeah, I mean, they're homies. He does Damn. hats too. Yeah, I still have to. Yeah, AD got gang hats. Go yeah, I've seen them. Oh God, he, 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 That's he a bad right. hat you got on. Like, most of the AD hats are custom or high price wear What's up hats. with a Dr. Dandruff hat? Can you, make, can you do my logo? Yeah. We actually could do that. Yeah, this is my logo right here. Dr. Dandruff in the building, man. Come on, man. So, I've, been, man. I've, I've been big in this shoe world and in, in this vintage world and the stylist world. So if you're a rapper, a model, porn star, stripper, whatever, and you need video shoots, photo shoots, you need to look fly or whatever the case may be, hit me up. I got you for your photo shoots and video shoots. But watch your aunties and your grandmas because he's going to get some throat. Yeah. yeah, and don't play, bro. I got shoes. <laughs> That's clothes. just mark it up as part of the game. Nah, that nah, part. Hey, hey, and that knows me, you feel me? Yo, they know look, I'm a, yo, I'm a look matters, bro. Head, you feel me? I, yo, I look love matters. hats. So, the yeah. look matters. Oh, my it image does. is everything, yeah, you feel you me? Yeah, you definitely got to tap me? into them. Every, every time before a battle or a performance, I always work on my image before hey. anything else, you feel me? What is, what's the site? God K Shoes, right? Yeah, God K Kicks. I got God K Fittings for the hats. God K Vintage for the sports wears. If, if you're a real football fan, you got to tap in. I got starter jackets from the 80s and the 90s. Oh, yeah? I got dope shit. I what about basketball shit? You ain't got no NBA shit? Somewhat, but like I'm, some Phoenix Sun shit. 
I'm probably, a Phoenix, I'm a Phoenix Sun fan. Y- y'all can stop me out Damn, on the end. Probably sucks. not Phoenix Sun. I'm a Phoenix Sun There's fan. There's no reason to invest. So you in from Phoenix Arizona? Sun. You got any Lakers shit? Oh, yeah, I got like, I got slight Lakers shit, but the Lakers shit will be more memorabilia. Like the T-shirts I got is like the World Champion 1987. Oh yeah, I'm gonna Lakers need that. Shit, I'm gonna need like that. that. Yeah, I got my whole room. Jersey's framed and shit. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we gotta talk, bro. News articles and all that. You feel me? You know I do sports memorabilia, right? Oh, I didn't even know that. Yeah, we got to chop it up. All the Laker jersey signed. Bro, oh, yeah, yeah. We got to chop it up. I got we a 19. Chop it up. I got yeah. a 1992. West, yeah, I got his Shaq. plaque signed, uh, the 81. Mm. His all plaque right. when he got the 81 points. I got yeah. that signed. You Kobe? Kobe? Yeah, I seen, I seen him in Vegas. Against Toronto. Yeah, he played against Toronto. Yeah. That's insane. Yeah. yeah. Rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. Yeah, Summer League, the and, goat. I, and I had that plaque with me and shit, and I was like, oh, I thought he was going to be an asshole, to be honest, but nah, like. He was Bro. humble. It was humble? humble as fuck. Humble as fuck. That's yeah. That's yeah, real cool dude. Fireful. Real cool dude. That's bad. Yeah, you, ain't, you ain't got nothing for trade. Yeah, I'm just happy I got to huh? play one time. I got to see him one time. In I person. wouldn't even ask him to trade that, but if he was down to trade it, I would have a so, whole bunch to trade. He, so my boy went to the he went to the game and, and when he scored eight. I wouldn't even want to. I went to the game. I didn't go to that game. I got the plaque. I got got him at a summer league in Vegas. You feel me? Oh, okay. So I asked him to sign it there. Oh, but I went. Shit. I went to. Um, I went to like. Did you get a games. picture or anything like that? What? Nah, nah. Then nah, we don't nah, believe nah. it. Hey, I, hey. I did. Discredit. No, 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 no. It's nah, just uh, nah, for because, authentication. Uh, yeah, it yeah, helps a lot. It. You're gonna need nah, it. because like. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. so me having a video of me getting an autograph from that, Joel Santana and Jim that Jones. makes it authentic. So now you could send that in to like uh, JSA. Or Beckett or whatever to get it. Um, right. No, it's called authenticated. Uh, to get it authenticated, yeah. so like people would like, trust you know, the they, they'll trust well, the fact of it. So you'll yeah. be able to buy, you'll be able to sell so it if you. You'll want. be able to sell it for like a they lot. They put their holog- but I'm, I'm, I'm they put their hologram on it. Like yeah. I got Jim Jones and I got yours. Oh, oh, the, uh, the diplomat. Yeah, if you, if you, I if you get it. And yeah, I if I get out, that's again. Hey, yeah, hey yeah, can we talk about rap shit? Let me talk about rap shit. All right, go ahead. You know where I mean, Cameron came from, right? Originally, what? That's what you're missing, Cam. Yeah, I'm missing Cam. Well, Cam. He had the shoes on recently. He did a skit with somebody, and he had the babe. I mean, Jim Jones is cold. He, he had the babe shoes on that I got signed. I mm. thought that was funny because I need him to sign that exact. You know, same you know how hard it is wearing. to get Cam. You know how hard it is to get Cam. Cam is hard to get. Y'all that don't know, Cam is hard as fuck to get. Not only was he, he with the Children of the Corn, right? Right. You said that shit earlier. Yeah. Children of the Corn. He was with Big L. Murder yeah. Mace. That's crazy. Yeah. Everybody from Hardem, that was dope. Yeah. So that's why I, I would think that Cameron is a little bit harder to get than Jim Jones. And Joel's. And Joel Santana. I only got those two. I filmed Cam- Cameron. And then you got Hellrell. I what Cameron about Hellrell? Uh, Hellrell? Hellrell's dope. Cam yep. was the star, There's really. There's a lot. Uh, Hellrell, uh, 40 Glock, uh, Agala. Shout out to my boy Agala. Who? Adolf. Uh, who? 40 uh, Glock. Hey, uh, who? Hey, I don't uh, really, I don't really think like forty blocks. Uh, like, what from about Agala? Adolf. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. But forty blocks. I'll vouch for him. Forty blocks. Agala made their beats. Made that sound. Glocks, the purple tape. Really, uh, forty blocks. The one from, from Dips. From Dipset. You know, forty blocks. The one that battle rapper. Battle rapper. Yeah. Oh, battle he battle rapper. raps, right. but he's not yeah, a battle a rapper. Battle but battle his rapper. his, his autograph yeah, is Kali not Smova valuable like it is. He called with, out Kali Smova. Like it's not even as valuable as her real. Killed. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, I wouldn't exactly. Get his autograph. Yeah, I want to get forty Kel's autograph. The shoe. But I just yeah, what? Like yeah. Hell, hell, real though. I'll definitely get his autograph. Like that's the man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell, real Cam. You feel me, Joels? I don't know about Jim. Cam is the hardest autograph to get. You got Jim? I got Jim already. Jim okay. was the first one I got. And then I got Joel. I just don't okay, like yeah, the bullshit Joel. that 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 Jim Jones did with fucking, you know, when he got chased out of Harlem with Mozzie. What Mozzie? What Mozzie from Sacramento. Never he got chased out of Harlem with Mozzie. Bad. Mozzie got chased too? Mozzie got chased too. What happened? I never he heard was rolling. Uh, they they recorded a music video actually together in I Harlem. Never, I never mm. heard that story. Yeah, in Harlem. Watch, well, check it out. It, it's real. Where's my All fact right. checker? Fact checker, so, where are you at? So on hip hop, uh, what do you guys think about Twenty One Savage saying uh, Nas is irrelevant? I think that's some bullshit because Nas will always be relevant. Yeah, I think he's a goofy for saying that. So he's not entitled to his own opinion. It's not that he's in, not no, no, entitled, but, I mean, but he's a representative in I mean, hip-hop, I'm a, I'm a, and his voice matters. So him saying something like that either shows, is is, is he... Uh, what if he was just trying to be a, is a, like he a good not, sportsman? Like no, to, no, you don't, nah, you don't, discre- you don't discredit discrediting Nas. Le- like Bro, a legend, you know what I'm saying? If, if Jay-Z is, is number one... 
And, why, why and is Nas feet Jay-Z in the back. Why do you say Jay-Z's number one, though? I completely don't think Jay-Z is number one. I don't think Jay-Z's number one. I don't think Jay-Z's number one. But in the terms of business right now, no, but in the terms of business right now, people give it to Jay because, because of his status. He's richer. Yeah, it's a status thing. Um, he's a billionaire. I, I, he lost to Nas is my point. Yeah, that's what I'm You know what I'm saying? saying? So if him. they say that he's the best or he's goaded right now and Nas beat him, you know, that's where... This is like the Geechee Gotti Cali Smooth. Shout outs to Geechee, not a knock, but the yeah. Geechee Gotti Cali Smooth situation. You know, like they, you know, Smooth doesn't get his flowers, yeah, right. but he beat who's goaded right now. Yeah. yeah. In yeah. all reality, you know, but people won't give him no flowers. So it's kind of like the same type of he knows situation. What it is, Feel me? Like Nas don't get his flowers, but like he beat your goat. If you guys are putting saying Jay Z's your number true. one, the the day, and he beat your goat, then what do you? No goats, bro. But I feel like everybody's entitled to their own opinion, even right. if it's wild or just crazy. That's I his. Mean, that's his shit. Like that, if Twenty One Savage felt like mumble rap is better but, than old but rap, he don't have who are we to be like? Oh, we don't care. We don't care. But why should? But I but Nas just put out a, a album, and he said it with that being. A situation yeah. so in that terms you're either trying to knock him which yep. you might or you're um you might it might backfire because they might go check it out now to see if so, you're lying and so, they might see so how look, good Nas look, raps look, look, look. he's probably whole, mad because he wasn't point. on the album no no i'm gonna help y'all out with, 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 with my point nowadays people get paid to give reviews true so people argue, oh, the bad review you gave fucked up this small business. You should feel bad about that. No, but he could. Yeah, but he's reverse. discrediting but, the legend. But, but what that I'm saying part. is, I watched like a, um, a talk show host bring on a reviewer and shame her for being a reviewer. He's like, oh shit, you reviewed this person and you fucked it up and all that. And the lady was innocent. She's like, nigga, I do reviews every day. It's not my fault that the product right. this bitch was selling was trash. But at the same time, I didn't look at it from the other point of view because you're reviewing. Small businesses, and you have to give a bad review to bad things. Of course, you are technically ruining that business. But what about a legendary, famous. a legendary so review? Is yeah, this is in um, a small business. Just because, right? But it's what, a what legend I'm in the game. Is, this is bigger than Toys R Us, my boy. Bigger than Walmart. What I'm trying to, while, while I'm trying to land with is, it's both sides of the fence. Right. You guys are looking at it from the legend standpoint, and I'm looking at it from the reviewer standpoint. I'm looking at it from a hip hop rap can standpoint. Be a reviewer. A rapper or a non-rapper. I'm, I don't battle rap. And I can review a battle rap and call a battle rapper trash. But if he reviews the same battle rap and calls it's that battle rapper trash, it's he gets politics. Though, yeah. That's different. Yeah, shit. because he's in the game. Right. So, 21 and he, Savage 21 is, Savage is in rapper. the game. Right, right, you know right, what right. I mean? But he's, he's an artist. So he can give his critique. And it's but your, but and it's who his else critique. does he step out of the way to say that on? I, I don't go that deep. You, know I mean? you think J. Cole would have said some bullshit like that? Like, J. Cole like has said shots at rappers before. Like, not Nas. Nas. Like 21 he got Savage. Respect for not Nas. What I'm saying is you have your own it's, But choice. it's because he respects the craft. Right. J. Cole and, is part of that mumble, cloth. Right. He respects then, the craft. And then 21 Savage is a mumble rapper. So what don't I'm saying is I already know where he was coming from, where he said that. So I'm not going to shame him for saying that. But this like is said, why. I mean, he didn't think it was foolish. Bias. How no, old? He was is, how old is he? I mean, he's to, like he's like probably like a mid twenties or something, late twenties. So he's so like he no one his age is bumping Nas, nah. so, so he don't even understand. You exactly. know what I mean? So, exactly. And so, and the way that he never heard Illmatic, the generation nah, situation. One, but like, no, no, not like, you. Twenty one Savage, but like had never like, heard Illmatic from one to fucking like ten. A lot of people I know are like you know like. 29, 28, 27, whatever, you feel me? They listen to Nas. Yeah, you know what that's I'm saying? what I was trying to say. But, but he's, so from, a different, so he's Nas, from a different region. So it's Nas Ill. Oh, yeah, that's true. Hey, regional Mr. regional is big is play. Yeah, that's true. For someone down there to pick it up. I was, I was blasting his diss songs and shit back in the day when I was in high school. That was still mad. That shit. was in 2000s. Right. I'm yeah, talking yeah. about the, the that young. shit that paid the way. You're talking about like I'm talking about Illmatic. Like 96. Illmatic. Nah, Illmatic's like, yeah. 94. Yeah. Is it four three? Think, yeah, yes, I think I'm even earlier. Illmatic. I think it's even earlier. I yeah. think Illmatic paved the way. He had no famous guest appearances on the ship, just nope. A Z, and it was labeled a bro, classic. Bro, 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 bro. Not because a classic, it, it was album of the year. And it was it's a classic. Just yeah, it was album it. of the year. It got five but bikes. A, a whole bunch of person. them are classics that look, year. Look, that look. was the classic. Ready to die? 
Yeah, think about, yeah, that think was about a, a good great, year. Think about a great person that died, bro. Like not Michael Jackson. Think or Outcast. Like, like, oh not yeah, somebody that California. Had, the uh, anti aliens, aliens was in that. Yeah. Just, uh, oh yeah, Prince. 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 Yeah. All right, but, but he was controversial too because okay. people say oh, he was gay. That was after. But just was think it? about yeah. somebody famous shit. who died with no controversy. If somebody oh. gives a bad opinion about them, people are gonna group up and say, "You can't say that about Patty Labelle." You can't say that about Oprah or some shit like that. It's not fair. I should be able to give my honest review on anybody sure. I want at any time I want freedom of speech. Yeah. But the masses will group up against you and say, you can't say that about Black Lives Matter, even if they stole. Yeah. All the black people are going to say, don't shame them, bro. Stand up with them. No, they stole. I'm tripping. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. how I feel general. Yeah. So even right. if I love Nas and my neighbor says Nas is whack, I'm going to argue with him right there face to face with all my facts and all that. But I'm not going to shame him. So I'm going to do shit later like when you all come. Do so the question is, look, is look, Nas look, relevant look, or not? Look, what I'm... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nas Back. will always be relevant. You know what? Because lyrics because will he's never die. No. Nas is always relevant because he's a legend. Once you hit legend status and whatever you do, you're always relevant. You already hit the he's mark that you needed to be. He's a forefather. I mean, come on, my boy. Right. He, his face is on Mount Rushmore. Yeah. Mount Flowmore. Like, I might Real say, time. like, conclusion. You heard what this nigga top said? Top lyricist ever, for sure. He's definitely in the top, in the top lyricist conversation. Said, man one said, no, so it's kind of heartbreaking when, it, when a lyricist hears that, that bullshit. That whatever, but I'm not going to go, like, talk shit about you in real life. I'm going to just laugh at you in a circle. Like, yeah. This nigga be saying, nah, it's whack. Like, and me and my friends going to laugh at you and try to convince you he's not. Yeah. But I'm not going to, like, He didn't even say he was that. whack, though. He just yeah. said he's not around anymore. He said no he's more. irrelevant. He's irrelevant. Like, nah. he's nowhere near. Irrelevant means he's, he's out. Irrelevant means you're whack. He was the past. Nah. If you were no, no, whack, no. you wouldn't be irrelevant. Irrelevant means, irrelevant like, you're not working no more. Whack. Like, you know what? Like, hey, you're, you're something part of the past. Yeah, irrelevant. Like, you're not, that, you're not working I, I correlate that the same. Irrelevant and being whack, I correlate the same. No, whack is a little more disrespectful. Show me somebody who's irrelevant that's not whack. Yeah, but whack means show something me different. You All can right. have someone who's relevant. Be whack. One. But what I'm what I'm asking Rock you is, him. show me somebody who's whack. Yeah. I mean, show me somebody who's irrelevant and All not right. whack. Nas got eight million five hundred twenty one thousand seven hundred ninety six monthly followers on just Spotify. Of course, he's not irrelevant. He's not irrelevant. Eight, over 8 million people are All listening right, to him on just Spotify. If he had 500 Spotify. subscribers, no, check, I'm check, irrelevant. No, no, check um, like Lil Pump, somebody who yeah, is but irrelevant. The, he's got a he's machine dead, behind he's him. Dead, and no, all that's what I'm trying to say. Check somebody who's dead. Lil Pump is dead. Yeah, no, so not check dead, somebody though. who's dead. Lil Pump. Lil Pump is actually dead. There's, what is, what there's does this videos. have to do with somebody being dead and somebody being alive? No, I'm about to see like how many. 6 million. So Nas is doing more. Doing more. Nas but, is always doing more. But he's dead and still got 6 million followers. Because you're nobody till somebody when kills you. When was the last you? time Lil Pump made music? That's true. And he still got 6 million. You're nobody till somebody kills he you. He got videos. And Notorious B.I.G. Rest in peace. Said Lil, it best. Pump, Lil Pump got interviews by multiple bloggers about him falling off. Because he was an interesting in the character. Four years. Yeah. He was and that's what they tell him. Like, Didn't they make a documentary and shit on All type of shit about him falling off, yeah. right? But, but but that's, Juice World, that's, Juice World. You think anybody? Million. You think any rapper? <laughs> yeah, but hold on. Watch this though. How many Lil Pump features is there out there in the world? There's a lot more Lil Pump features out there than there is Nas features. So he's also booming off of features he did. Oh, he's back booming then. off of his death. That too. But I'm saying people are carrying his music off of features as right. well like, um, Nas don't that. really what do about, features like so that doesn't Nas have to. ain't uh, have to. So Nas no, 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 ain't an industry ho he's getting his plays from himself what I was comparing this, like you're looking at you Nas got people right, like, right. you got people like Triple X to Tashion. I know yeah, he's, I he's doing better right he's doing better than both the people we because just mentioned he's dead yeah. no I, I was gonna add in and he's dead but I, I don't even have to search it I know for sure he's pushing better numbers than both of them and he's been dead but is he relevant or not? Because he's dead. He's relevant. He's still relevant. He will, yeah, always, he's relevant. he will always be relevant. He, this is the difference. There, there's um, people that have fans and people that have a, a hardcore fan base. That part. You know what I'm so saying? NBA like, Youngboy. Um, there's NBA come and go fans, fans and there's NBA, forever NBA fans. NBA Youngboy has forever fans. Drake has forever fans. Those two people. They have forever fans. Yeah, yeah. Have a forever lot of these fans. other dudes don't have forever fans. You paid fans. the way for yourself. You're yeah, always going to have fans. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, and like, they 20, could. 21 Savage could start rapping and I don't think anybody would care like that. Yeah, somebody said that in the, in the argument. Yeah. No, in the argument, somebody said, um, 21, if you stop rapping right now, you'll be irrelevant. Like, nobody cares about you. I guarantee you 21 Savage got way more sales than anybody else. Actually, like, as a matter of fact, I went and He's seen always Nas gonna be relevant. and Mary J. Blige He's at the Hollywood like... Bowl and they sold it out. That's the Hollywood Bowl. And I think my tickets are like 
three hundred and some dollars each Shout ticket. Shout out, Mary you know J. Blige. You know what I mean? So yeah. was it who's like more relevant, some Twenty One or Nas? Are you paying three hundred and some dollars to go sit like Nas to will go always see, be uh, more relevant? Twenty One Savage. Nas is always gonna be more relevant. Like I don't think Twenty One be relevant without Drake. I didn't say time. more relevant. I say like. Right it's now, one right now, relevant over the other, basically. Yeah, Would you pay three hundred and fifty dollars yeah, yeah. to go see Twenty One? I don't think that that. No. Did, I, I don't think that, that that describes the answer though. It does because Nas is selling out shows at it that does. price. It's like, it's, like Joe, it's like Joe Montana and Steve Young. They're they're. But um, I want to hear some music in a car, and I want to hear some area. music on the stage. That's what I'm trying to say. It's a different oh, okay. area. So just though, because I don't buy your okay. song, don't mean I won't listen to it more. So you can still stream it. Yeah, I'll still listen to it in the car way more than I go to the. So I'll go to Nas concert for sure. Yeah, but or if Twenty One had a, a freak Nick, I'll go to Twenty One over Nas. But in general, I'll go to Nas and, and Mary J over Twenty One yeah, all the yeah, time. Yeah. Until they say Twenty One got one in ATL and it's booming, then I'm gonna stay <laughs> over that for that one. But to answer your question, to be non-biased, yes, Nas will win. But at the same time, he won't win car play. He'll just win no, the definitely. night out with my girl. So but I'll take my girl. He won't concert, even win the veteran but, the veteran vote. Well, that's he again. won't win because we're not gonna. Me and him are not gonna go with Twenty One Savage. We're gonna go with what paid us. Yeah, but this what paid is, our way. But this is the other thing too. Is like that's again Twenty One Savage also is a feature whore. You know what I mean? Like fools but really the guy get can spit though. He's oh, an no, artist. I'm not knocking him. I okay. listen to Twenty One Savage. I like Twenty One. But what I'm saying is because the new game. I mean, it's only the smart thing to do. If, you get a whole bunch of features so that you're you're booming in a whole bunch of lanes. If you got the money, you don't even have tricking to. If you got it, when you but he's even people are paying him. Yeah, feature, feature, that's feature. What I'm saying, he's but the everywhere. Guy, the guy's relevant so, like a motherfucker. So you're getting plays from like a whole bunch of fan bases are carrying. So Nas is Twenty One Savage that. only relevant because his Drake features? No, I think Twenty One. No, but that boosts him. Yeah, twenty one. Twenty one's relevant because he's paid the way. He's a good artist. He, I think he could spit. I think he has bars, my boy. Even his though he's in is somewhere Kodak else. Kodak is better. Kodak is better. Yeah, you got Kodak crazy than a motherfucker. I, I, I agree. You crazy as shit. I don't know. I, I yeah. will so say has, I like he certain has songs. Hits. He has yeah. hits. I like certain songs of Kodak so better than Twenty One, but at the same time, I think Twenty One's better 21 as an artist. Merc. I think I think Kodak makes better hits than Twenty One. Me too. I think he'll win the verses. Even if Twenty One can rap better, Kodak can sell more. But let's say we throw on a beat right now and we tell him. Both to spit. Who spits better? Kodak gonna win the verses. Not never. Yeah, Kodak no, I'm not gonna talking win about verses. verses. I'm talking about we're rapping. talking about just rapping as a craft. Yeah, because that that starts going into politics and hits. Like just because I mean, it's a you, hit doesn't you wanna... mean that you're rapping. Most people, most rappers, as we know, being in this situation, most rappers know that. Like if you tell them their their favorite, their personal favorite songs or what they think they spit the hardest, it's never the hit. True. The hit is just some goofy shit for the world yeah, to just, go ahead and you know, sing along to. That's right. a sing along song. That don't mean it that you could spit. But when it comes to when they're standing in front of each other, man to man, and we know we both rap, and we got to rap right now on the spot. Who's better? I mean, if that's not the case, not making songs. But at the end of the day, know. but I'm not talking about rapping. Hold on, hold on. I feel, I feel like, I feel like if that's the case, then like if you they want to do battle rap, then cool. You could you could try to see who's better. But not even battle rap. Just with what? Just no. Because you're gonna make money with those. Right. You exactly. Me? Now, yeah, that, but that, so, that, you're that, so you're talking about money. But we're talking about who just Gremlin, better. Super Gremlin versus uh, 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 how many people you shot a lot? How many you got a lot? Who has more numbers? I gotta look that one up. Look that one up. I don't even know. That's a good fucking question. Sure. Uh. I don't even know. And to tell you the truth, I guarantee you both. Uh, both fans of Twenty One and Kodak Black like both of them. The thing that is, is the hard part. Is, yeah, the thing is, is Nas right. has done shit right like that. like Gun, where that's he told statement. the story backwards and that's all that. A rewind. Off I mean, of rewind. Still still and then Matic. Gun, where he to- talked about himself in the boy. perspective of a gun. Feel me? Like that's like crazy. Did. Like did. That's yeah. crazy. Like um, next level writing it skill, is. bro. Like rewind was so rewind was stupid, crazy, dog. bro. All right. Was it gangsters and honeys with your head done? Pull up a chair, hun, and put it in the air, son. So when you line these, like that's this what guy, that's what man. I look at when you when you talk about um, actual spitting and shit. Like when we go to the depth of like, there's only certain people that ever hit those levels. Like um, Jizza, he used to have the songs right. that he used to always do the one topic with like labels. Right. You know right, what I mean? Right. He spit. Everything had the record labels in it, but he rapped it just regular words. Oh, of and course, he it, did uh, metaphorically. Yeah. He did uh, what was it? Uh, 
Queen's Gambit or one of them. Like, you talking about what? Like where he was doing like, the football. Oh, Wu Tang, you talking about? Yeah, just yeah. lyrically though, like taking it to the next level. Um, Wu Tang was so hard. Um, so two people did this one. Um, Papoose, Sticky Fingers. What about Papoose with uh, the alphabetical so if you're gonna, sorter? Okay, time out. So if you're gonna talk Papoose, Gift of Gab did it first in 1996. Mm. Black Alicious, you know what I mean? Eighty. You know your shit. So when when I heard. Pap, it didn't impress me. I just That's I heard true. a lot because he you recycled a lot of shit. Of he did. Gift of gab. So yeah. I was like, oh, you're using the same shit that he did. Okay. Two you, Max you fooled did it too. everybody. Two Max did it before. Two Max did it yep. too. Uh huh. Facts. Know? Yeah. But you know, Gift of Gab did it first. So yeah, I always right. give it to the person that, and he probably did it the best. If we're gonna be one thousand, like if you put them all together, Gift of Gab went fucking got it. crazy. He Rest did. in peace, Gift of Gab. Yep. You know what I mean? Gift of Gab. On some real shit. Um, That's some crazy shit. Crazy, bro. And I mean, the thing I'm is, I've seen him, my boy. Like, I've seen him perform in like 1998 or something at the L Ray. It was like uh, Rozelle, Black Delicious, or Beatrix, Beatrix, and Rozelle. Roots. Some yeah, people don't even know roots. who the fuck we're talking about yeah, right now. That's he, the he scary was, part. He was still in the Roots. This is like 98. Rozelle wow, was so um, hard. Yeah, bro, that shit was different. I was in high school. If I fucking you told my homie out. My exactly. If, if you were trying to get with me, oh come on. The shit with Slick Rick. Bro, get your old ass out of here, man. Now that's in. real hip hop shit. Man, one loss. Come on, put us in. We you don't know who the Roots are? Oh, we know who the Roots are. But we don't know what y'all talking about. So Rozelle yeah, 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 was right. from the Roots. He the was roots, a rapper yeah. and beatboxer the from the Roots. No, that's Quest no, Love. No, that's Quest Love, yeah. So he's yeah. the Quest drummer. Love, yeah. He's the I drummer. the Quest Love ones before. Who else was with the Roots? Um, Black Thought. No, Black, one of yeah, the goats. Wait, Black wait, wait. Thought. One of the Black best Thought. beat makers ever. White boy. He was with the Roots, right? Who? Scott Storch. Oh, Scott Storch. No. No, he wasn't with the Roots. Who was he with? Scott's he was I working think, yeah, he was, free agent. Yeah, like he yeah, was he with was, Dre. He was with the Roots. No, he was with Dre. I thought he was by himself. He was with the Roots. Scott Storch. Scott Storch was with the Roots. He started with the Roots. Why are you making really? that claim? How you know that? Check it out. I <laughs> know that. Say it ain't so. Say it ain't so. When somebody's firm like that, they're coming from some type of fact. Say it ain't so. They yeah. from some fact. Scott Storch. He's not just making it. He's a man on the floor. Yeah, Scott Storch. And Scott Storch. Popped up Scott Storch Roots. Let's see. What is it? He was with the group. I know it, it might have been the Roots. It has to be one of the mem- one of the first members of the hip hop groups. The Roots. Thank you, what? ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. That's I didn't even know that. I didn't even know the Roots. I, I didn't even know that. Today. I'm a low level That's psychiatrist. fire. I learned something new today. That's that shit fire. crazy. I didn't even know that. Even though, okay. hey, to get on your That's subject, beast. to get on your subject, yeah. he That's was with Drake. Yeah. When Dre yeah. had got him over to his house, yeah, he said, yeah, all right, go ahead. Thanks. He even kept him captive in his house. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scott yeah, yeah, Storch yeah. has most of the beats off the chronic. Why do you do that yeah. one? Yeah, because I don't remember when <laughs> 2001. That's just yeah, that's crazy. crazy. Scott Storch was and part of the room. And he's not even on yeah, the fucking credits. I didn't even know that. Yeah, that's fire. He's not even on the credits. Bro, Super fire. That that is wild. Yeah, yeah I didn't know that either. Yeah, I didn't know that. But that is super fire. I'm here all night. Yeah, hey. yeah, that was hip hop <laughs> facts right there. You say it for some type of facts. <laughs> hey. He knew, he knew I was, he knew I was serious. Yeah, yeah he was like, you, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a low level psychiatrist. He I was like, hey, this motherfucker's serious. It derived from fact, so he knew something, even if he was wrong. We, we, we was gonna pull up something to correlate it. For yeah. sure. Yeah. Nah, I had to see that because like that's level. fire. Low level <laughs> that's fire. Now he, I'm gonna have was to go the back and re-listen to it. He was the original beat maker, the piano guy for the for roots. The roots. That's fire. That's and then he went his own way because yeah. they ended up giving him a deal. And he became huge, the star that he is now. Yeah. You know, the That's person crazy. that blew $140 million. What were the roots on? on? They were on American? They were on American records? They were on American records all day. Thank you. Yeah. That's They're crazy. crazy. It was crazy. That's know? dope. Scott that was, that shit. was fire. Yeah. yeah. Shit. He's the only motherfucker nah, I know that Scott blew 140, uh, no, know 840 million on cocaine. Right. But we don't know none of the roots of the roots, so we lost. The, the roots of the roots. So roots are from Philadelphia. Yeah, Black Thought. They were the like shit. the was that first. Hill and shit? No, no, no. That that's the, the Fugees. Fugees. That's, the Fugees. that's what White Clay. So yeah. um, the roots were a Philadelphia group that were a band. Feel me? Mm-hmm. Um, Black Thought is like a beast when it comes to oh, lyricists, yeah. top lyricists yeah. ever. He's definitely in that. You could Black go look up. Uh, Black Thought Wild. Who, Black who's, wild. was it with Sway where he did like he did that, that eight minute fucking yeah. rap? Yep. You don't have the answer, up, Sway. Yeah, look up Sway. Uh, Black Thought. 
dead ass. Look up Sway Black Thought. It'll be one of the craziest. How, Sway? How, Sway? You don't have the answer, Sway. Not only that, wasn't he on that Sway super lyrical? Sway used to have the super answer. He was on that super lyrical I with, with Big you. Pun. I he had you. some fire. Bro, the shit that he did with... Uh, with Big Pun was the greatest fire. shit ever. Yeah, but I'm not, I'm not a very big... Oh, no. Big Pun. Why? I'm thinking... Super big. lyrical. Yeah. He yeah, did yeah, Big yeah, Pun yeah, yeah, and Black yeah, Thought. Yeah. Yep, that yep, gotta yep, be yep, the yep. hardest fucking Spitter. Oh my goodness. Uh, you know which one other space. other two yeah. that Man, I let throw me in know it? This bitch up. All yeah, right. motherfuckers gotta be fucked up. We can't play it on air, but no, no, no. um I'm, I'm read you the, lyrics. the the Nunca. You ever heard the Nunca by uh Chino XL? Chino XL was so hard too. Bro, he has a song called Nunca where he spazzes. Was it Cuban? Puerto Rican? Puerto Rican. Um, Puerto Rican. Puerto Rican. Yep. <laughs> You don't know who Chino XL is? You don't know is? who Chino XL oh is? Oh, my God. I know, I know so that I'm is. A, I he was on never, a breakfast I'm going to send you. I know who that is, but I just never, like, All right. heard a song. So, okay, so Sway and Tech. I know what it is, Sway, you don't got the answer there. They used to do a thing called um, the Wake Up Show. The Wake Up Show. And okay. that's where all the spit. You're signed to Crooked Eye. That's where yeah, he yeah, came yeah. from. You yeah, can yeah, ask yeah, him. Yeah, his yeah. his Crooked Eye from Long Beach. break yeah. was yeah. being on Wake Up Show. Everybody got broke on Wake Up Show. C.O.B. crew, yeah. So when they... When they go in the wake-up show, the whole thing was you got to okay. spit on yep. the spot. And they used to bring you in with some of the craziest spitters yeah. ever. Like Eminem, all of them were in there back then. I think both of this, them came up on the show. On the same show? Yeah, yeah they Cro- had beef. Crooked Eye and Chino um, XL both went on the Chino same XL show. Chino XL had beef with uh, Eminem from that shit. The lyrical most spitter be literally like, <sighs> dude, bro, he used to go crazy. I got, I got this super lyrical. Now, dog. They used to, um, so they would just go on the show and flex like cannabis, all of them, yeah. all the spitters. You know what I mean? Yeah. Motion Man, shout out to Motion Man. Yeah. Yep. Like real spitters would go in there and just na 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 go yeah. crazy, bro. Ooh. Like you you had Big to go L, on the Big lyric, L, Big you L? had to go on the wake up show to really Big be L certified from Harlem, as the only a Big spitter. L. Rest in peace. Rest like, in peace. Because they would make you go in there and go like. Yeah, so go, yeah, yeah, that's where everybody got the respect from. Low key, like back then, that that's shit. where wow. we respected our lyricists from. I got this motherfucker right here pulled up. I'm gonna play the song, y'all, because of copyright, you know. But this ain't my lyrics. I'm just letting it know right now. This is that big pun, that super lyrical. That first verse was so stupid. He said, hey, yo, my murderous rap verbal attack is actual fact. Tactical tracks match perfectly with graphical stats. Just that right there. I'm already done. I'm like, fuck. He said, half of you lack. This big pun. Hey, yo, my murderous rap verbal attack is actual fact. Tactical tracks match perfectly with graphical stats. Half of you lack the magical dap of tragical rap. You had a. You, Are you fucking serious? You seen how I did the big pun breath though? I like that. I like that. Look at it. He used Black to Thought. do that in the in between his breath. Black thoughts coming off. The super lyricist, your arch nemesis, still with the Punisher. That's my accomplice. Stressing the MCs how they don't really want this. Electrifying shit is his excellency through spit. These cats, these sentimental, such with a gentle touch, dancing double Dutch, and all saying nothing much. Like, dude, this motherfucker's right here was spitting so much compound, it was ridiculous. Black Dot. Yo, I, don't hear, I don't hear rappers spit like that no more. They don't because it's all about just, you know, like. Because I remember when I, when I was getting lyrical on my shit, a lot of people were like, nah, bro, like, you got to be more commercialized. Yeah, well, me? it's just different lanes. You know what, you know what I mean? Yeah. Everything got a lane. Like, yeah. this is the thing I used to tell people because for a long time I was that underground hip hop head that I didn't want to listen to anything that you didn't spit. Yeah. If you didn't yeah. make me go, Ugh, then you ain't shit. Then I don't give a like fuck Jedi about mind anything. Tricks. Jedi mind tricks and everybody. I wasn't really a big fan of them, particularly not knocking them. Shout outs to Vinny Paz and all of them. Tragedy they did their Gaddafi. shit. Um, but I, I Guru. I, I didn't really Gangstar. Guru, of course. Rest in um, peace. Um, I got to meet Guru. I was uh, no. working with Cool Keith and we did what? the House of Blues. Fire. Get Gangstar? the fuck out of here. We did the House of Blues right. and Guru uh That's performed. It was fire. just him. Damn. It was around the Jazmataz days. And That's um, fucking awesome. Yeah, bro. He was cool as fuck too. Like we were right there, it was like me, Cool Keith, Cutmaster Kurt, Fathead. What? Yeah, okay. and we were like, What up, what up, guru? Da, da, da. Like we all came out the green That's rooms wild. and we were walking out. It was after the performances. That's so dope. we were walking out like the VIP door and shit. Right. And he was walking behind us after us. We we're like, Oh shit. Yo, he was legendary. like he came That's like, some shit, Yo, what up, man? Fucking, da, da, da. Uh, you ain't never gonna it, Yeah, you know, rest in peace. You, you ain't to gonna the see that shit. Bro, that's why I'm saying he met Kobe. Like to me that's Kobe is so crazy to me. To me, like that's the god of all god, goats of all. If you think about it, bro, like before I started, before I started even rapping, I was playing ball because Kobe. You feel me? And 
feel me? Like, Damn. I seen Kobe on that quarter, and I was like, yeah. I'm, I, I need this signature. I played, I played ball yeah. since I was eight, you know, up to 16, you feel me? Start playing football. I used then, to play against uh, Trevor, Ariza. Trevor yeah. Ariza. Trevor Ariza? Trevor Ariza. Yeah, he used to play for Westchester. I played for Venice's leagues. Yeah, so we Trevor used to have to play Ariza. them, you know what I mean? And, and he, he was, was like, dunking and he was on like Trevor Ariza, god yeah. damn. Nah, I mean, Imagine no one knew Kobe who he was, fuck. but he was dunking. Like, we didn't know. Yeah. We didn't know who he was. Oh, he was dunking he was on us, though. Yeah. yeah, we were little kids, like 12 years old, 13 oh, years old. But he was already, like, dunking, bro. Like, it was <laughs> retarded. They were throwing yeah. all the oops. I wasn't even a basketball fan like that. I was in the skateboard and shit. Yeah. You know what's crazy? My cousin, he played NJB basketball with Kawhi Leonard and Moval. Kawhi Leonard's Fire. cold. Yeah, yeah, yeah he you is. Feel me? He's a cold and motherfucker. Like, and, like, I seen him play live one time. Clippers King, are waxed, though. Because, like... Me, he was like playing in the ribs. I was like, okay, I heard about this kid. And now, <laughs> like, seeing him on the like a star on the TV, that shit crazy. Yeah, Why is dope, though. He just like seeing him as a kid and shit. Mm-hmm. Wow. Man, I done met all kinds saying. of motherfuckers too, but me, I'm more yeah, of in, like, into comedians, you know. Like, I meet Facts. Michael Blacks, and I meet, you know, like That's if fine. I meet Eddie I Murphy, him. I'm going crazy. Hey, if you meet Eddie yeah. Murphy, take me, Hell call no. me. I'm taking Face eight time. pictures, <laughs> blurry and blurry and all. That, yeah, that's my favorite yeah. uh, comedian actor. Like, uh, I, I met Harlem Corey Nights. Oakham. I mean, now me and Corey are like cool as fuck, but Corey's a fucking hilarious. When I, I, when I, I seen it. him, I was starstruck. I was like, Corey's right here. I got you know to uh, film. I'll be starstruck too, though. Corey Holcomb is He's legendary. fucking funny, dog. I got to film uh, Mike Epps. Uh, See, you already know. I got legendary. D. Ray Davis. Oh, I, got to film, Ray Davis. I got to I film Michael Blackson. Michael Blackson. Rest in peace to his uh, partner that he did his podcast with. We were with him, Who's too. That, the, uh, the Asian dude. Uh, I forget his name. Some Asian or Chinese man or something crazy. He had a crazy name, but it was his partner in his podcast. Damn. Yeah, he wanted to bring Cali Smooth on the podcast, but he passed away. Mm. Yeah, after we had met like yeah, right after we got his numbers i met him when like, uh teddy ray uh passed away you know mm, rest, rest in, in peace, peace teddy, teddy ray, ray. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Crazy. everybody was so there, how man. is it like uh doing these roasts with these comedians you really be in there roasting with top heavy hitters i know you be roasting it's like, a lot easier i'll tell you that it's a lot it? it's a lot easier it flows no it's a lot easier at home oh. hey, bring, mm. hey bring me on there so i can shoot on you you gonna shoot on me? I swear Let's to God. get it What's right up? now. What you talking about? You look like the Sandman from fucking Punch Out. Man. Oh! <laughs> if, I look, if I look like the Sandman, then you look like the Green Goblin from the Ooh. rainy, the rainy universe. Mm. God damn! Your nose he so went. big, you can smile a fly shit. <laughs> you look like Aaron Carter before death. BD. You look like a, a YouTube barber. <laughs> Look at you. Damn, he said a YouTube. You look barber. like the lead singer from NSYNC. You look like you stay at home while your baby mama work. <laughs> <laughs> you a backup dancer from Maroon 5 Your hair, yeah. your hair look like dirty shoestrings <laughs> <laughs> You the manager at Walmart Your lips look like ashy hot links <laughs> <laughs> Your uncle is the mayor of every city Your teeth look like tombstones <laughs> Oh shit You the master of hopscotch You look like an abusive husband you sell Lunchables without the crackers. You beat your bitch up over the last Newport. <laughs> you, got Capri, you got Capri Suns with no straws. Uh, <laughs> you got them for real on deck. Capri Suns with no straws. That's you own, you yeah. own the whole Amazon universe. You look like the back of your neck stink. <laughs> you look like a 2K My Player. <laughs> a, a 60 overall. <laughs> a 60 overall. <laughs> You, you buy your outfits on a Target with a discount. That's crazy. You look like your stove is dirty. <laughs> you have sex with the male landlord. Sheesh. Uh, that was fucked up. That was fucked up. You gotta pay your rent somehow. Damn. <laughs> he said you have sex with the male landlord. You drop, you drop weed bags when you're shooting dice. Oh, mm. I, I got 10 on 5. <laughs> my, my boy sell dummy brocks. Look at you, <laughs> dummy brock. Damn, he said you got the drywall. I don't, I don't know what else to say to Diggy. Hey, hey, we gotta, he, he, he we gotta wash those headphones after you take them off. <laughs> <laughs> Disinfecting. My man, my man was born from a family of plumbers. Like oh a, shit! You look like a plumber. Hey, you, look, you, look like a, you look like a tractor mechanic. Look at you. <laughs> my man does uh, tattoos from scratch. <laughs> Handmade machine. Spider wear tattoos. <laughs> you look like the security for Uber. You look like, like every evil villain from a uh, from a Marvel show. You look like you chipped your tooth over opening up a Corona. You look like Thanos with no uniform on. <laughs> <laughs> you snapping fingers and shit. You got Great Dane mouth. 
<laughs> you look like a white manager from old uh, radio stations. You got uh, Down syndrome lips. Down syndrome? <laughs> what? <laughs> you, a, <laughs> you a grown man from the American Pie movie. You just grew up. You stiffler. You, you stiffler. You mom. got a mustache like a fucking Italian painter. <laughs> you cook Italian food. But you Mexican. I'm done with this guy. Oh, <laughs> <Italian food. laughs> You don't know how to skateboard. You play with a tech deck. Hey, the cop shot him, and the bullet came back and said, I need a flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> this man will pull up to your birthday with the whole taco kit. And this man you will go to your... Stand, taco kit. And this man will go to your barbecue and take over your grill. <laughs> God damn. He got an apron on. You look like you gave Mike Tyson his first loss. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you look like an MMA fighter with a dress on. <laughs> You look like Arnold Schwarzenegger before he was the mayor, governor, and the ru- ruler of your town. You look like a dyke truck driver. You look like you look like, <laughs> Termin- you look like Terminator with no powers. You look like you look like a gay Fantastic Four character. <laughs> you look like a short Tony Hawk. <laughs> you look like Tony Hawk in his twenties. He still looked like he was forty. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you look like Hey Arnold Grandfather you with the nuts in. Oh. <laughs> hey Arnold, get your oh, come on your shit. shit. You look like yeah, Doug. Yeah. Remember Doug and Skeeter? Come I like that. Shit. I like that. I like that one. I'm from the '90s. Remember Doug? <laughs> Doug and Skeeter. Skeeter. You had look the like long a middle head. school bully. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a middle school step teacher. <laughs> step teacher. Step, get your step teacher. Get your step teacher. <laughs> You look like a kid that Angelina Jolie adopted. You built like future. a you built like a gorilla knee. You look like the, you look like, <laughs> you look like the man that we talked to in a Catholic church. The one that's behind a little screen. You be you, talking to you him ashier than a Newport cigarette. Look at you. You look like the dude that stole all Easy Money and they came tripping. <laughs> <laughs> you look like your <laughs> You look like you look like your belly button stink. <laughs> You the manager at Skechers right now today. <laughs> he called off to do the podcast. You know that, get you, your heels. You type. Fly- he got a wheel in his shoe right now. He's skating he this shit. Heels. Get your get your rollerblade. I'm on your shit. You don't I got no. Get one free. <laughs> you, don't, you don't got no shoe stopper on your rollerblades. You just be rolling all day. Hey, at the end of this battle, all you're gonna hear is day after your, day. Picture me rolling. Shut your Cleo looking ass up. Oh, day after day. Oh, they call me Queen Latifah, Queen Cause oh. you're living single. You you, you the nigga that got pressed and set it off. What's the protocol <laughs> when a gun is in your head? What's the shit. protocol? I'm on your shit. What's the protocol when the gun is at your head? Get oh, your. Shit. You look like your, your your tongue make your gum stink. <laughs> Fuck out of here with that bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me shit. see. What, what else? What else? Come on, my boy, get on it. Da, 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 da. Yo, ear so big you can hear self esteem. You the nigga who, who, who passed the Mexicans on next Friday. Oh, hey, what about my board? Racist, no. What about my board? Look, get racist, you should have been in the way. Oh. Roach, get your grown roach. He roach all grown up after Pinky fired him. Damn. Damn. Yo, te- yo, yo, teeth look like Indian corn. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> he called him roach. <laughs> roach. The, the uh, homie shit. know where to get the best meth, meth at right now. He'll sell, you, he'll sell you a good ounce of meth. You right look like a June now. bug in, in November. You look like you press e pills. You press e pills. <laughs> you press e pills with your bare hands. Your, your face looks like a piano roach. <laughs> oh my I'm god! I'm done with this. Movie. How about your shit still? Hold on. That's just funny as fuck. You look like your older sister beat you up all your life. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Oh hey, shut God, up, my boy, I'm real talk. Hey, yeah, this is how we hey, do it. Hey, yeah, man. that was fun. I love that. I love that. If I was really in my bag, we would have went longer. But yeah, hey, he had to go get his bag from his, from his Mazda. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, I, I haven't been rustling in a long time, but I need to get back on my shit. That shit. Hey, you do it, real talk. Hell yeah. This is really be on things. I remember I told a girl, it looked like you brushed your teeth with fireworks, and Ooh. then I did the action. Boom, and everybody went crazy. That shit's stupid. That's crazy. You look like you got swap meat blanket lint. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking done. <laughs> oh my oh, god! You play shit. special ed, red light, green light. They only got two colors though. And you teach a, a <laughs> pee- <laughs> <laughs> and you teach and you teach fucking midget pee wee league. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah, I'm about to sign up. Oh, uh, shit. I'm about to sign up. Oh, that's fucked up. He threw himself under the bus. That was yeah, that's that's funny. funny. Bitch. What's up? That's hey, that's funny. Arsenal. Hey, yeah, y'all give it up for Arsenal, no Rebel. <laughs> Arsenal, no Rebel. Arsenal, no Rebel. You know that Arsenal, Arsenal, Arsenal and DNA had a kid. Uh, 
<laughs> you look like Battle Black P with a mohawk. You look like uh, DJ K Fade. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> DJ K Fade. You look like Sharon after a three year bid. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. That was a good one. That was pretty good. You got dandruff on your eyebrows. After a three year bid. Because you got the tattoos and shit. That's fucking out. That was oh pretty good. That was pretty good. Like it out. You know he didn't tell him nobody he did his bid and all. I like that shit. Real talk. That was funny. <laughs> That was a good one. Uh, shout yeah, out to Sherelle. Shout out to my boy, Dan. Shout out, shout out. Hey, like shout out to my boy, Real Talk. So, shit, if he a famous roaster, I just got mine in. Yeah, hey, God hey, K hey and all you Dan motherfuckers Dan out there, hey, you got beef? Get some shit. My boy Bro. just, hey, my boy just stood up to me, Real hey, Talk. He did. I got to give it to my shit. boy, Real He charged, too, so, you know, he he do this professionally, and he yeah. gave me one for free. Yeah. That's hey, my hey, feature. And shout out my boy, hey, shout out my battle rapper boy right here. Hey, you got to be this tall to get in this ride. On some real shit, this is my G right here. Yeah, and that girl who fucked his cousin. That's incest, bitch. No, that's not incest, but you did wrong still. I was wrong. It was a, it was you, a play, cousin. <laughs> you just said my cousin did me a favor. Man, one. No, the bitch did wrong. Your cousin never did wrong. He tried to tell you. Look, 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 look. look. If you would have listened to him and broke up with her and he still fucked her, I would have been mad at him. I swear to God. If you would have listened to his advice, yeah, and then he would have yeah. doubled back and fucked her. You still he worried about wrong. that? Look at his, his glasses but got foggy. Yeah. He, like he kept foggy. it real and tried to tell his dumbass cousin the truth. He was in <laughs> love. Yeah. So you let it slide and he watched you. You a cold nigga. He like, this dumbass nigga still love this bitch and she keeps trying to fuck him. What's wrong <laughs> this with this nigga? Double back. That's some bullshit. Double back. <laughs> you don't back. <laughs> 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 How we get back to this conversation? <laughs> <That's> <laughs> he just yeah, wanted to rub it in a little bit more. He tried to call me out. He said, hey, and before you leave, remember that one time your cousin fucked your bitch in front of your face? I still feel like your cousin was right, bro. Because you didn't listen, bro. So what else was you supposed to do? Hey, he said, hey. And all we have to you don't hang out with that bitch or don't hang out with that nigga no more and you don't listen, she keep your ass in the house. So everybody do it in a different way. Just because you don't listen, it's going to make the security go up. My boy, I got it. Oh, baby, you... You, you got, got what, what I need. need. <laughs> did you say he's just a friend? Hey, did you say this love has taken its toll <laughs> on me? She said goodbye <laughs> too oh, many times before. Oh my god. <laughs> Heart is breaking for <laughs> me. I have no choice. I love it, I love I can't it. say goodbye anymore. Hey, I love your shit. I love that boy. Hey, see this motherfucker's quick. I like it. And on that note, that was, that was one of my. Um, I love it. I love it. That was one of my accolades in high school. I was quick with it. People yeah, like that. Like that. He, he rapped it with it. Uh, Even though you smoked people, 33 blunts. A lot yeah, of people lost to me started. because and I built like going. a punching bag. Yeah. Like, people can't handle the roast <laughs> when they're not a roaster and you keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This was quick. Like, he's he's he, nice. He did me a favor. He's nice. He, he tried it a few times when I was when I started getting him. He started rapid attacking me, which we do when you're a professional yeah. roaster. You hit them with yeah. the rapid attack because they can't get in between your jokes. They yeah. they laughing off the funny shit. Ain't nobody can get in between you, period. Exactly. You a big motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> and and you trying shit. to fight me outside, dog? I'm just running to the car. Like, hey, hey dog, get us, <laughs> hey, dog, come on. I came over here for this shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? This motherfucker beat my ass up. That's the sad man. He got uppercuts. <laughs> he got uppercuts. <laughs> the hop. Doom, doom, doom. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, hey, real talk. I don't know. Let's get it, my boy. Yes, yeah, that, sir. Shit was, that shit was fun, bro. I ain't got a roast session. In a I long love it. I love time. it. That's yes, my guys. So, again, thank you guys for coming out. Dr. Dandruff in thank the you, building. Thank you. Man, you're, one you're, in the you're, building. You're my co host, God K. God K in the building. You know what I'm saying? TC, the Honor Roll Podcast. It's been a long one. It's the oh, longest yeah. episode. Yeah, long Let's do it. Have fun, funny. man. Hey, until next time, baby. Good one. Fine. Let's do it. Yep.